Chubbers is back, baby. <laughs> yeah. Woo. Chubbers the moon seal is here. No longer empathize. We won't even talk about that. That arc is over. Those two months of torture are done. We are now infinite. We are strong. We are Chubbers. <laughs> Yeah, baby. New phone, who dis? Yeah, right. <laughs> uh, it's good to see you, Goldie. It's good to see you, Stick. It's good to see you, Leaf, as well as Nexi. Yeah, we're back to being chubbers. I probably have the longest name in the history of ever now. <laughs> it's like 19 letters long. Ah. <laughs> <sighs> Empathize never existed in the first place. Look how cool this is. Look at us. We're chubbers. Yeah. My emote prefix is now back to being chubby five. <laughs> yeah. It was all a dream. Yep, it was all a dream. I don't know what you guys are talking about. Oh, man. Feels good. Feels good to be back, everybody. Feels good to be back in chubbing. Back to being the chubbers. Back to being on brand. We can start actually doing things again. I can get my life in uh, in order. <laughs> oh man, I'm doing good. Doing good, Nexi. For real. I'm pre pretty happy and excited about this. I've been waiting. I've been counting down the days. I was counting down the minutes and the hours. Yesterday, I was just like, oh, man. Had everything laid out and planned out. Everything should be changed and fine now. <sighs> Feels good. Feels good. Yeah, good to see you, Yen. Good to see you. How about you, Steph Nexi? How are you doing? How, how is everybody doing? It's good to see you. Today, we're going to start a new game. A game that I've never played before. Going to be playing uh, The Legend of Zelda. Breath of the Wild, which I'm kind of nervous for, but mostly excited for Bobby, because you're super cool. you're so cockily, that's nice. yeah, because uh, I don't know. I've I've seen gameplay of it before, and I've I've, I've always wanted to try it out, and um, yeah, never never played a Zelda before. <laughs> never play never played a Link. I don't even know what a princess is, so. This will be interesting. This really will, will really be interesting. I'm, I'm excited about it. E, yeah. Super cool. Super cool. Cost me 60 bucks. <laughs> but you know, I have you guys to thank for uh, watching all them ads. <laughs> I appreciate it, guys, honestly. Uh, very grateful. Very grateful. But I'm, I'm so excited to be playing this. Um, I couldn't afford the DLC. So we will be playing on like Normal difficulty, I guess. Won't be able to pull what Toya did where we play it on master mode, but that's okay because not everyone is Toya. So, you know, is what it is. Is what it is. So, Princess is what I don't have. The old stinky linky. The old stinky linky. <laughs> I'm excited. Very, very excited. Let's go ahead and we'll dive on into. Into, into the game checking if the software can be played you're damn right it can yeet let's hope everything's connected correctly <laughs> I hope so <laughs> I didn't really test it to be honest <laughs> one day one day stick one day Yeah, of course, I hope you've been doing good, everybody. Always love hearing from y'all. Let me pull my mic closer here. Birthday in three days? That's what's up. Let's go, shtick. Y'all any plans for it?
Man, I woke up like only an hour ago. Can this light... <laughs> Can we go back to dark mode? <laughs> Welcome to the bonfire, unkindled one. Well, thank you for the follow, Levi. I appreciate it. It's time to unga bunga, baby. <laughs> then touch the darkness within me. Let's go, racket. Let's go, baby. You're damn right. You're damn right. Thank you so much, Racket. Uh, let's see. Controls. Okay. Inventory. Adventure log. Memories. Things that I don't know. Okay. Uh, jump. Action. Jump is X? Oh. Put away. Oh, jeez, guys. I'm going to do so bad. <laughs> All right. Um. Oh, that's a jump. Okay, so you hold down B to run faster. Oh, jeez, guys. I'm going to do so bad. <laughs> so bad. Alright. You can swap X and B in the options if you prefer. I'm gonna I'm gonna try my best to live at the controls they give me. We'll we will see. We will see. <laughs> I'm gonna try my best here, everybody. Basic controls? Okay, so that's just what it says there, okay. The controls are definitely a bit wacky. They don't look wacky when other people play it. <laughs> you know? Okay. So that's how you save. Auto save, okay, okay. Okay. So far, so good. You digivolved, you're damn right we did. That is a Sheikah slate. Take it. It will help guide you after your long slumber. Sheikah slate. <gasps> it's a switch. Mysterious tablet with a glowing center. You've never seen this device before, and yet there's something familiar about it. <laughs> they gave us a switch. A switch light, at least. What's up with that purple thing down there? It like shows that noise is happening. That's a trip. I've never seen anything like that before. Yeah, thank you so much, Racket. I'm I'm so, so many things are happening today. I forgot to really thank you, man. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Racket. Twenty one months, man. Twenty one months. Oh, it helps with the sneak. Okay. How do you sneak? Oh. Okay. Sneaky, sneaky. Some trousers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll do that when I feel like it. The 
should probably wear the item or read the item description. So take nourishment I can from pick these sovereignless up. souls. L R. Oh. <laughs> Apparently, I picked clicked the wrong R. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Let's take a look here. Thank you, Goldie. Link's morning breath of the wild. A thin shirt made long ago. It's coming apart at the seams, but it's better than nothing. The sleeves are a bit too short on the short side. These old trousers are the red. Take nourishment from bearing. these sovereignless souls. <laughs> uh, thank you guys so much. Thank you guys so much. You guys are too kind. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, Goldie, for the 100 bits, and thank you so much, uh, Wreck It. Thank you guys so much. You guys, you guys are too great and too kind. Making me nervous here. 20 month months should be a new Twitch baby celebration date. Twitch baby? <laughs> Opal Twitch baby? What? Okay. So we got the key items. Okay. Rotate. What do you mean rotate? L, R. Oh. After a nine month sub, a new Twitch baby is delivered. <laughs> I wonder how many Twitch babies we have going on. Uh, yeah, I've never heard of Twitch baby. That's really funny. That's the first for me. And we got the temperature thing. Apparently, then temperatures touch the thing. darkness within me. Next, eh? <laughs> you guys started a hype train. Damn it! <laughs> oh man, you guys are gonna be earning emotes. Choo choo! <laughs> Thank you, guys. Thank you very, very much. Guys, I, I haven't even stepped outside yet. I'm probably gonna die to the first thing I go against. You guys are you guys are making me nervous here. <laughs> Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Pick up and throw. Pick up. Drop. And that doesn't break it. Okay. Alright. Alright. Take nourishment from these sovereignless souls. Racket! All-time record shattered. All-time record for what? We got a record? What? <laughs> Been excitedly waiting for you to begin Breath of the Wild. Dude, this is gonna be terrible. I'm already so nervous. <laughs> And thank you guys so much for the hype train. I, I, I'm I nervous. Thank you, Racket, for the 100 biddies. Take nourishment no, Racket, from no these more. sovereignless souls. Everybody, we're, 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 we're good here. We're done. <laughs> we're done. <laughs> Gonna have myself an anxiety attack. I don't even have a sword yet. Hold the Sheikah Slate up to the pedestal. That will show you the way. Show me the way. Do you know the way? <laughs> thank you for the hydrate. And thank you so much, Record. <laughs> yeah, thank you everyone. Thank you so, so much. You guys are all too kind. Ooh, what are you animating, Opal? Looking pretty good, Link. Woke up from a bath, Take got your new rags from on. These sovereignless souls. <laughs> that must shine upon high rule once again. Take no. nourishment from these sovereignless souls. Shine upon high rule once again. I guess we have before. I don't know what that means. I don't know why we were in that hot tub, and I, I don't even know what a high rule is. 
I don't even know what a Hyrule looks like. Oh. Hey. Climb down. Whoa, that was sketchy. I'm trying to make an ocean at night. Ooh. Goldie! Dang it, guys, stop playing into each other's madness here. Okay. Okay. I'm trying to get used to, like, this idea of climbing. I rule. The opposite of low rule. Okay. Okay. Oh, here we go, guys. We are Lonk. Looking for Zelda. In the breath of the wilds. And we need to save Hyrule. Apparently. You're in for such a treat. The type of baguette. <laughs> yeah, thank you, thank you, guys. You are, you are all too friendly. Too kind. Good to see you, Voltanis. Yeah, Chubbers is back, baby. Wow. Things look a lot nicer than I expected them to. We got a stick. Wooden branch such as this are pretty common, but surprisingly well balanced. Doesn't do much damage, but can serve as a weapon in a pinch. Use weapon. Okay. Good enough for me. Hey, mushrooms! And a bug? Can I take bug? Bladed Rhino Beetle. Beetle's razor sharp horns demand that you handle it with care. Boil the horns alongside monster parts to concoct an elixir that will raise your attack power. Oh cool. Mushrooms! Common mushroom found near trees. Around Hyrule. Oh, so we're in Hyrule? Oh, okay. Eat <laughs> to restore half a heart. <laughs> okay, thank you. I don't know how to eat yet. No one taught me how to eat. <laughs> Press and hold. Or, and that's a switch. Okay, so we got some branches. Some climb. There we go. So far, I think I'm doing good. So you hit things like this. And you, you switch weapons like that. Okay. Yeah, Voltanis. So right now, everybody decided to give me a, a, a panic attack by starting a hype train and saying all happy and welcome and saying that I'll enjoy this game and making me nervous. I'm, I'm really nervous. <laughs> So right now I'm trying to I'm really trying to take my time with this game, obviously. I'm trying to read like the item descriptions. Get used to the Man, the graphics are like really good so far. Am I tripping or is this how it always is in this game? I'm gonna pick up all these sticks because I I'm gonna need it, I feel like. Can I, can I hit the squirrel? Come here. Oh. Wow. Ah. What the fuck? Link. Head for the point marked on the map in your Sheikah Slate. There's a point on my Sheikah Slate? Follow the Sheikah Slate. Current location. Stamp. Stamp what? Shrine of Resurrection. Whoa. That's a big map. Okay, so go there. 
What are up with these words I've never seen before? Apparently it's plus 60 Fahrenheit. <laughs> which means it's like... I don't know what that is in Celsius. Yeah, we got this little mini-map here. I didn't, didn't even really realize it. I wanted to take a picture of the squirrel. Can you, can you take pictures of this guy? Man, I should have taken pictures of those mushrooms. So it's like very nice in Hyrule right now. You can, but not yet. Aww. I want to take a pic. <gasps> what are these? Apples. Gib. Good to see you, Dammy. How you doing? How you doing? And I'm doing well, thank you for asking. Apple hype. <laughs> Apple hype, you're damn right. I wonder if there's a way to eat things quickly. Oh, I can whistle. Oh, my stick, no! <laughs> Apparently I can wipe my butt. That's something. Dun, 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 dun. Little dashes. Okay. Okay. Um. I imagine like pausing in the game. Like uh. Oh R. Oh R allows you to go through it quicker like that. A common fruit found on trees all around Hyrule. Eat it fresh. It looks like it increases its effect. Okay, so eat it fresh and it increases its effect. Okay. So you can eat it, like, in the pause screen, I guess? This is gonna be fun. <laughs> yeah, Leaf, I have no idea. Give that stick the business. I know, I just threw the poor thing. Is there a way to cancel the throw? Stick, I don't want to throw you. No. No! <laughs> How do you... Okay, B should work. There we go. Okay. <laughs> I don't want to throw the stick. Hey there, old guy. Hey, what's a douche? I don't know if I should take it in front of him. It's probably his. How you doing, homie? <laughs> well met, stranger. It's rather unusual to see another soul in these parts. Who are you? Hmm. Me? I'll spare you my life story. I'm just an old fool who has lived here alone for quite some time. What brings a bright eyed young man like you to a place like this? Where are we? Well, we were told it's Hyrule. I mean, come on. Answering a question with a question. That's fair enough. As I cannot imagine our meeting to be a simple coincidence, I shall tell you. This is the Great Plateau. According to legend, this is the birthplace of the entire kingdom of Hyrule. The Great Plateau. Yeah, I kind of look scary. Hmm. The temple there. Long ago, it was the site of many sacred ceremonies. Ever since the decline of the kingdom a hundred years ago, it has sat abandoned in a state of decay. So there was a decline of the kingdom a hundred years ago, huh? Yet another forgotten entity, a mere ghost of its former self. I shall be here for some time. Please let me know if I can be of service. Um, gonna take this apple. It's a baked apple. I thought I thought the apple said that it's best eaten fresh. And now suddenly I'm seeing that I earn more heart for this. Oh. I beg your pardon. I do believe that is my baked apple. You can't just go about taking whatever you please. I had a feeling this was your apple. I had a feeling, my man, I swear, if you heard me earlier, I, I even said, and I, the, uh. 
I cannot resist pulling your leg. Son of a bitch. Please help yourself. An apple and an open flame make a succulent tree. Um. So you got food and materials. X is hold. A is to select. I want to hold it. How do I cook this thing? What does far do? Yeah, anyway, I'm gonna drop it in. <gasps> the apple's on fire! It's baked! I made a baked apple! Nice! I'm moving up in the world. Listen to Dumbledore. I don't wanna listen to him. What does down do? Oh. I can throw the apple at the fire. Watch out, old man. Yeet. Big apple, let's go. Didn't know you can throw stuff like that. Yeah, I said like far and I'm like far what is this a stick that I can use to hit stuff with it's a torch this torch will stay lit once it's ignited but if you put it away the flame will be extinguished well then just help yourself to that torch there and how may I ask are you planning to use it set things on fire it's a secret oh um, um well I was planning on using it as a torch <laughs> because it's a torch. <laughs> Set things on fire. That is rather unnerving. Please be cautious with that around anything dry grass and stuff like that. It'll catch on fire. You know, there's plenty of monsters in this area. The torch would make a good weapon if need be. Hmm. However, do not just swing it around without purpose. You must face your opponents and lock your sights on them. Okay. And that means you're my opponent, aren't you? Huh? Oh, little bitch. Oh my gosh, fuck. <laughs> Enjoy your lurk, Nikki. No love to you, gotta do work. Three meetings, blah. Much love to the moon seal. Much love to the lazy shark. <laughs> it's always good hearing from you, Nikki. Okay, so now we have a torch. And apparently if I light it on fire... Um... How do how do I just equip this thing? Like how do how do I how do I take it out? You know what I mean? Oh, square or not square, but why? Oh. Okay, how do I put this thing away? Fire! Fire! <laughs> yes! Yes! I have become God. <laughs> All right, well, that's cool. How do I put this thing away? Eh, good enough for me. I'm scared to accidentally hit people. I'm relaxing by the fireside. Of course, although I'll need to cook myself another baked apple at some point. Simple food, such as an apple, are fine and to eat raw, but roasting them on fire makes them tastier and more nutritious. So light everything on fire. Okay. Doobie doo wop. Gonna go kill something. Hey! Old man! Is this your axe? Cause now it's mine. Really hitting you with that apple guilt. I know, right? It's like I could I can bring you another apple. You can take one of mine, dude. It's okay. Woodcutter's tool of choice for felling trees. Formidable weight and uneven uneven balance make it slow, inefficient weapon. Oh, but the stick is good, huh? Show me how to throw a weapon. What? When I picked up a stick, you didn't want to tell me about it, but when I pick up an axe, suddenly it's like, yeah, let's have him throw this thing. Apple. Huh? Apples. Apples. 
How do I grab that apple? Eh. I have an idea. What if I throw a stick at it? Yeah! <laughs> Fuck yeah! I am innovative. Old man! I'm gonna bring him back an apple. Just because he's being a little bitch about it. Alright, um... Buttons. Apple. Hold. I'll even cook it for him. Grenade inbound. Yeet. Did it cook? What the hell? Hey, give me give me a sec, old man. I'm I'm still learning here. There you go. See that there? That's yours now. Well, I guess you don't really care. Wait, I think the apple... Is it not... <gasps> well, old man, he didn't eat it quick enough, I guess. <laughs> well, shit, man. Can I make a mushroom? I can bake a bunch of mushrooms. Mushrooms! Watch out, old man. I'm sorry, it's okay. I didn't I did not mean to light you on fire, man. That was a <laughs> that was completely my fault. Okay, he's, he's forgiving. Dude, I just made a bunch of mushrooms, bro. You guys, you guys want to do some mushrooms? Dude, I got so many mushrooms and so many apples. Alright, we're good. I learned a good mechanic there. And that rock over there. Like a sword. I'm scared to swim, though. Now I got this axe. I'm gonna keep on trying to use a tree branch. I wanna use the axe for... Well, it said I can chop down a tree, didn't it? So what innocent tree am I gonna knock down first? This one looks good. Nice. Now what do I do with this? How do you pick up an item? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> um, A? What do you do with the... What? Nope. Don't do it. Hmm. Well, I never was much of a lumberjack. Broiling chicken today? Oh, nice. You're talking about that yesterday. Tree murmur. <laughs> this time it's a fat of yesterday's chicken, so I'm going to be extra savory. Ooh. You chop me down. I'm yelling timber. <laughs> Is that a little bitch face over there? What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do, huh? Tree branch is badly damaged. Just broke it over his face, that's what I did. Oh, 
Okay. So far, so good. He came at me first. We all saw that, right? Ooh, more mushrooms. Get it nice and crispy. Yeah, it's all about that fat. It's self-defense. Yeah, it was all self-defense. Oops. Hmm. Nothing really around here. Man, I broke some of my branches too, man. At least one of them I did. Gonna grab everything I... Oh, don't tell me you're bad too. You're too cute to be bad. Is there a way to switch to the next weapon very quickly? Choo choo jelly. A gelatinous substance that came from a choo choo. It's unusable in its state, but applying it to an elemental stimulation will change its form. Huh. He just wanted a hug. He wanted to be stimulated elementally, alright, which I could not have done for him. Some choo choo goo. Choo 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 goo. Oh, hey, another tree branch. Now, I didn't think my tree branch would break that quickly. I have a little bit of a little baby of a tree branch, right? I want to look over here. I'm going to take that. Whoops. Oh. Taking your weapon too, fool. <laughs> what was it that I just did there? I said to press Y. Oh, I did press Y. Nice. I didn't know if I clicked the wrong button. Because I, I don't know the buttons. <laughs> like, on the controller. I legit, like, I don't even use the switch. So this is like, everything is really new to me. <laughs> You can do flurry attack, so do you press it like a whole bunch of times? The severed horn of a boko bokoblin. A creature often encountered in the plains of Hyrule. It isn't edible, but it can be tossed into a stew with some critters to make an elixir. Oh. Yeah, just smash Y during it. Okay. Good to know. So you get perfect dodges like that. Okay. Looks like me and my, uh, souls strategies are coming in, coming in handy around here. Perfect dodge though, huh? That sounds complicated. Oh, I can't break this. Okay. Wait, you don't have anything equipped? Oh man, it's badly damaged. <laughs> okay, whatever. Oh yeah. I'm trying to jump and I keep on clicking the wrong button. Search. Ancient screw. A screw used in ancient machinery. Made of unknown materials. No matter how many Bobby times it's cool. turned, it's the thread okay, never seems to show signs of wear. No signs of wear, huh? That's pretty cool. Thank you, Racket. I appreciate it, me. I am pretty damn rad. Pretty dang cool. Oh, water. Is it getting to be nighttime already? No, I'm just, I'm just exploring. I'm scared of nighttime. <laughs> well, who do you? 
you think you are, huh, buddy? Ah, son of a bitch. Okay. Oof. I'm gonna go pick up your weapon. Then use it against you. I can't. Okay. What a formidable enemy. Now I can actually try to eat something, though, for the first time. Boko Club. Or Baco. I like saying Boko more. Alright, let's go and, uh... Hmm. I want to eat a mushroom. Ooh. And he was swinging. Scared the hell out of me, man. Hey, we got some trousers. Traditional dress trousers of Hyrule. The plush fabric makes these trousers quite comfortable. Their high durability makes them ideal for traveling. Is there durability in my pants? I hope the things I wear don't have durability. So you got four to two. Oh, that's what it would be if I put it on two to four. Okay. Okay. No, we got some nice pants though. No. Nice. Okay. Okay. Temple of Time. Why does it look like there's something in there that is going to kick my ass? Well, there's butterflies flying around it, so maybe it's safe. Hello? Ancient gear. A gear used in ancient machinery, despite being incredibly old. Its build quality is leaps and bounds above anything built using current technology. Hmm, so we got, like, old technology around here, huh? Hey, grab the butterfly. Oh man, I wonder if he can. And the speed that the camera moves is really slow. I wonder if there's a way to speed that up. Don't use amiibo. <laughs> Is that supposed to be fast? <laughs> Alright, good enough for me. We'll go left. Hey, what's down there? <gasps> Those are pots. There might be a fastest. Ooh, let's see. Very fast. I guess I should be grateful, right? It's something I know, right? I'm like, well, I guess I should be happy with that. Arrows. Bundle of five common arrows. The shafts of these arrows are carved from the wood of a sturdy tree. Man, see, I tried knocking down a tree earlier, and I did, and then it ran away from me. So I need some more tree shaft in my life, huh? 
Welcome in, Lax. Hope you're having a good day. Another ancient screw. Okay. A spring. You have to float on water. No matter how many times it's compressed, it never loses tension. Nice. I don't know what's the importance of getting... <gasps> Another enemy. Oh, you want some of this? Take it! Taking your club, too. Because these things seem to work. We really are going unga bunga in here. Toto once again. <laughs> Welcome in, Toto. Let's grab this. I hope you guys are having a good day so far. This game is huge. It's really pretty, too. Like, so far I'm really liking the colors and all that stuff. Busy day, busy life. As they say, right? Bomb arrow. Powerful arrow designed to destroy monsters. Explosive powder packed into the tips ignite on impact, dealing massive damage to anything caught in its blast. Arrows. Oh. Oh, I don't have a bow yet. Yeah, all I have is bonks. Oh, man. And so even breaking things uh, wears down the durability. Hey, we got a bow! <laughs> Let's go! A small bow used for travelers for protection. Does not do a lot of damage, but it can be used to attack foes from a distance. Draw a bow, release the fire. And what button did they say to... There we go. So now we have a bow. That's pretty cool. So you can hit things, throw things, and bow things. Okay. Oh no, don't throw it. Okay, I'm kind of... The controls are pretty weird for me to get used to, but... You know, if I just take things very slowly... Have some patience with myself. We'll be a okay. This game auto saves a lot. I almost don't know if I need to save. But it seems like it saves over itself. Like the save that I did earlier, I don't think it's there anymore. So, that's something. Let's see, right here it says uh, use bow, throw weapon, focus. Change weapon. Attack. Put away. Good to go. Oh, my Sheikah Slate. I forgot about that. Yeah, we've kind of been uh, not following what the game wants us to do. <laughs> we've been kind of going off in our own world here. Aw, oh, man. No chest in here. That's cool. We, we got a bow already. Pray? Might as well. Got a statue smiles upon you. Oh, it's a statue that smiles upon everybody. That's good. Get a little prage done.
So far, I feel like I'm going to have a lot of fun with this. Man, it looks like really, really good. Like, I'm really surprised at how, like, detailed it actually is. What does this path go up to? Check that out soon. I want to see if I can grab this item here. Oh, I already did. Okay, cool. Now, I don't know if I should go up this way because... It's pretty snowy. Got that sword over there. Alright, check that out too. Probably too cold for me up here. Spicy pepper. This pepper is exploding with spice. Cook it wait, cook with it to create dishes that will raise your body's temperature. Ooh, and help you in cold. Nice. Oh, it's too cold. <laughs> it's too cold in there. Oh, is that a camp? Camp of hooligans? Like, who the hell did that? Uh-oh. Uh-oh, guys. Oh, shit. How do I switch out of the... D Put that thing away. Look, guys, I didn't... I didn't mean to. Okay, one death. Nice, I did a jump attack. Hoorah! A shield? A lid? Wait, a pot lid? You make me want to play this again. Do it. You got to wreck it. it smells vaguely of poultry broth. Yum. It can take quite a beating before breaking. Raise your shield. This and hold. Oh, okay. So the same thing for focusing. You just naturally have a shield. Ooh, we got a spear. And a fang. A tooth obtained from a bokoblin. Or a bokoblin. I don't know how to pronounce it. It's worn down. Not very sharp. But still pretty hard. <laughs> Cook it alongside a critter to create an elixir. Okay. We got a spear. Got some horns, some spears. I wonder how many items I can carry. Seems like we're almost uh, reaching the point of having too many items here. Welcome to the bonfire, unkindled one. The player of Zelda. <laughs> Thank you for the follow. Lax, <laughs> same with you. It's been fun, like, so far learning how everything works, and we haven't even really dove into it yet. Can I take this? Ooh, we got a snake! Has a number of uses, did it say? Huh. Hey, there's the arrow that I shot earlier. Nice. Whoops. Trying to... Can I climb onto this? 
Apparently not. This thing isn't on. I wonder if I can make it do fire things. Let's see. Let's see here real quick, actually. I want to... If you have the arrow out. Put that away. Okay. Trying to learn the controls here. Oh, jeez. Uh-oh. I'm setting fires on accident. Put it away. Put it away. I did. Now, is there a way to, like, point this forward? To try to light this on fire? Uh-oh. That's throwing it. No. Don't want to do that. Um... Guess not. <gasps> oh. You press the Y button. <laughs> Ooh. Okay. Good to see you, Professor. How are you doing today? Okay, so now that that's lit, I wonder if I can, uh, like, make stuff. Mighty Elixir. Grant a low level might effect. Which strengthens your body and mind to boost your attack power with all weapons. Huh. Hey, we have a recipe thing? Where's the recipe thing? It said that you can check recipes. Yeah, good to have you here, player of Zelda. Ooh, gonna be playing some Dark Souls today, Professor? I hope so. Smokey the Bear is not impressed. P pretty upset at me, I imagine. <laughs> pretty upset, which, you know, honestly, I, I, I must agree. I'm not much of a pyromaniac, but it seems like in this game, it's kind of fun. <laughs> Nothing wrong with randomly saving. Anybody have an idea how to check recipes? Oh, by selecting... Oh, it even said select recipe. It had the tip up there, but I couldn't see it. Inventory, adventure log. Hmm. Well, I know that I said this. Let's see. Cook it. Oh, wait, no, cook with it to create different dishes. So let's see. Maybe we can make. Some like heated mushrooms. <laughs> Spicy fruit and mushroom mix. Grants low level cold resistance. This dish contrasts the sweetness of fruit with the savoriness of mushrooms. I mean, all I did was put a pepper and a mushroom together. Wreck it with the baby chubbers. Come here, baby chubbs. This is a game they're actually allowed to watch. Just got done with the Hollow Knight ending. And I can move on to Dark Souls 1 for a while. Exactly. You should be excited. It's freaking awesome. 
It's a lot of fun playing those games. Hmm. Okay, so I can cook up stuff. I wish I can cook up multiple stuff at the same time, you know what I mean? I mean, if I do this. Mushroom skewer. Holy crap, I just made like... Well, so you use the pan to make like... Special things. Oh. What happens if I... Let's, let's do like... Three peppers together. Spicy sautéed peppers. Nice! Lowers the cold. Let's see, what if we uh, do like three apples? This is just what I'm going to be doing for the rest of the stream. This is just... <laughs> Simmered fruit. Has a five heart. A five two heart. This sweet dish is made for heaping taste. Or wait, no. By heaping tasty fruits into a pan. And simmering until tender. Huh. Well, we got all these things. Critical cook. Nice. What is a critical cook? We got a lot of food. <laughs> we got... We're doing pretty good here, guys. We're doing pretty good for ourselves, I must say. I just wish I can figure out how to look at my recipes. At least you can cook in this game. It's a lot of fun, yeah. I really played Nintendo games, other than like the Wii and 2DS. Nice. What games would you play on uh, the Wii and 2DS? Yeah, for now, I don't know how to uh, navigate finding, like, my recipes and stuff. But maybe in the future I can. We will see. I wonder if there's, like, a way down from here. You... Tamadachi life from nice, nice. Wait, do you have like swimming uh stamina? Sw sw swim anima? If you get that special jingle, you get a critical cook. Extra benefit for what you cook. Like better buff or more hearts. Ooh, okay. <laughs> Yeah, I was confused because it said, like, five next to the first heart. Do you know what that means, uh, Nexi? Rusty broadsword. This once fearsome sword has seen better days. It can do some damage in the right hands, but also breaks quickly. Aww. I will carry that sword around until the end of my days. I will not let anything happen to it. What happened? You can you can probably drown in this game, huh? Oh, okay. So it showed five five heart with one heart next to it. So I mean six hearts. Oh, cool. Okay. I didn't know if that meant like it had five uses of two hearts. You know. Are there bosses and stuff in this game? I assume so. Pretty sure. I know there's like things that attack you. Huh. 
Can I push that boulder down the hill? Nice. <laughs> nice. Uh oh. Want some of this? That's what I thought. Take your choo choo jelly. Good to see you, Liquid Fox. Welcome on in. Can't carry any more weapons. Hmm. Let's check and see. Well, do I really need two torches? Then again, like, I think we're kind of doing good on... Well, the spears are kind of cool. It keeps their distance, but... Yeet. That's so cool you can throw them like that. No, no, I'll admit, I kind of like the spears a little bit more. But that's okay. We'll use this for now. I think I saw one of those goblins over here. I want to show him who's boss. Looks like one's sleeping. Oh, damn. I'll take this. And that. Have a good time playing some of the souls. I appreciate you stopping by for a bit, Professor. So if someone hits me while I hold the shield. I imagine I guess it just kind of holds back a little bit of the damage. I wonder if there's parries in this game. And if so, I wonder how to parry. Of course, that's going to be one of my first questions. How, how do you parry? Let's take a look at our little map here. Seems like we're getting close to where it wants us to go. Can we pick these? No, okay. Don't want to miss anything important. Ooh, stuff over here. Gonna be sneaky stealthy. <gasps> Well, that took them out. Holy crap. I wonder if there's like a fast, fast to dash down. I don't, I don't think so. I'll definitely take this. And there's stuff over here, too. I mean, it says to go this way, but... Oh, 
Uh oh. Apparently the the bow can only shoot so far, you know. Oh man. Oh sh Okay, okay, okay. Oh my god, he just one shot at me. He just that blue guy just one shot at me. The brutality. Well, be careful of the blue guys. You would think I would have learned my lesson. Little do they know, I'm kind of stupid. Just need to get close enough to shoot that little thing right there, you know what I mean? Yeah, you guys know what I mean. Gotta be more careful. Oh, here comes the blue guy. Oh, fuck. <laughs> blue guy, no. Blue guy, snap. <laughs> you were supposed to die in the explosion. <laughs> you little shit. That was a sneak attack. What? <laughs> Ooh, we got a bow from him. Change bows. Guys, this guy is so strong. Why, why do they make him so strong? <laughs> My gosh, he's gonna he's gonna he's gonna clap my cheeks. Oh wrong button. Okay, okay. Guys we defeated him! Yeah! Let's go! GG! Woo! <laughs> I love that emote. That's such a good one. I wonder what we got. What do we get for our hard work? Fire arrows. Oh. Mm. I mean, cool, I guess, right?
I had to go through so many of my weapons. I just threw everything at him too. <laughs> I was like, take this and that. <laughs> take this. Ooh, just eating the skin. That That is the good stuff too. That's the yummy. <laughs> Damn, that thing took him out. A lot of arrows. Thank you, man. Oh, man, a lot of arrows. Do I watch One Piece? No, I do not. I don't. I don't really watch too much uh, anime. I know of One Piece. I know. I know someone who knows quite a bit of One Piece in chat right now. <laughs> Man, I don't want to use the sword. I don't want to break that thing. What's a One Piece? Yeah, I was like, I know somebody who knows a little bit about One Piece. Mr. Nexty. Ooh, we got a sword! A common sword often kept by travelers to fend off small beasts. Fairly durable and a bit unreliable against monsters. Buckle shield. Bokoblin. Bokoblin mage shield created by attaching a hand hold to any flat tree bark. Oh, okay, okay. A hand hold to any flat tree bark. Picked up off the ground. It's pretty shoddy, so don't expect it to last very long. Cool. Then we also have, uh, what would it be? Let me go like this, we can switch our bow. Cool. Kind of learning a bit here. Good to see you, Miss Murder. Spoilers, there's a piece. I've dabbled. I've <laughs> dabbled. Anime in general? Not really. I don't. I don't really watch much TV in general. It's soon, eh? Good to see you. Yeah, I don't, I don't know what what we're talking about here. <laughs> it's beyond me. The Sheikah State or Nintendo Switch? That's what they're asking for. A one piece? Isn't that a type of swimsuit? Oh, look at the little squirrel. Whoa. Whoa. 
Whoa! They're growing everywhere. We have erected the towers. So this is how you know where you've been. They're like the little watchtowers in Assassin's Creed. Nice erection, much tower. <laughs> I killed by a coblin earlier. You think I can deal with this? Before it's too late. No oh, hells, no. Is this like an elevator to go down? Take me down. Okay. Is there a way to see the track that you've you've left behind? Rip. <laughs> Rip. <laughs> <laughs> Look, man, I don't talk about that. We know I don't know. I don't know what you're talking about, man. I don't. I never died. We can zoom in and out. It's DLC only. You believe? <gasps> Why? That's such bullshit. Nintendo. Nintendo. That's all I have to say is Nintendo. <laughs> Why you do this? I know, right? That's that's what I think too. Yeah, Master Mode definitely shouldn't have been just like DLC. Like it's a mode, dude. It's a mode. It is what it is. We'll just have to keep track of things ourselves. I'm scared to jump down, man. I'm gonna. <gasps> okay. All right. Whoa. Quite the enigma here. The enigma. I don't know what that means.
It's almost as though a long dormant power has awoken quite suddenly. You do not mind me asking. Did anything odd occur while you're on the top? I heard some voices. Well now, a voice you say. And did you happen to recognize this mysterious voice? Nope. I see. Well, that is unfortunate. I assume you caught sight of that atrocity enshrouding the castle. That is Calamity Ganon. 100 years ago, that vile entity brought the kingdom of Hyrule to ruin. It appeared suddenly and destroyed everything in its path. So many innocent lives were lost. For a century, the very symbol of our kingdom Hyrule Castle has managed to contain that evil, but just barely. And there it festers, building its strength for the moment it will unleash its blight upon the land once again. It will appear that moment is fast approaching. It appears. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> Must ask you, courageous one. Do you intend to make your way to the castle? I, uh, I guess so. <laughs> I had a feeling you'd say that. You're on this isolated plateau. You are surrounded by the sides by steep cliffs. No way down. Huh. If you're to try to jump off, well, no death could be more certain or more foolish. Of course, if you had a paraglider like mine, that'd be quite another story. A paraglider? <laughs> Piqued your interest, have I? Yes, I didn't come soaring down here on my own feathery wings, you know. Hmm. Were we not? I will happily agree to give you my paraglider, but not for nothing. Hmm. Let's see now. How about I trade it for a bit of treasure that slumbers nearby? <laughs> Good to see you, Owlatte. Venture log. Hmm. Come. Do, 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 do. Me and this old man were friends. Teaching me stuff, he's gonna give me a paraglider. Why right now, old man? It's like Simba and uh, his father. So he did that. After your descent from the tower, the old man told you about the kingdom of Hyrule that was destroyed a hundred years ago. You heard a voice in Hyrule Castle. The old man said that he'll give you the paraglider in exchange for the treasure that lies within a hidden location somewhere. Hmm. You see that structure there? The one shining with the strange light? Oh uh, yeah, actually I do. Began glowing at the exact moment those towers rose up from the ground. Sus. <laughs> I think such a place might house some sort of treasure, wouldn't you? Treasure for a paraglider or fair exchange, I believe. Okay. That sounds good to me, my man. Nah, what what glowing cave are you talking about? <laughs> Please be more specific. Oops. I gotta go over there. Wonder. Huh. Okay. There's nothing like on the map telling me like, yeah, go that way. And I want to go over here and fight these guys, but there's a lot of them it looks like. Let's save real quick before we dive on into here. Hide behind the tree. You won't see this coming. Come on. 
and shrooms, everything is glowing. Everything looks so pretty. Come on, turn around. Seems like they're all just chilling out together, huh? Maybe if I... Bomb time, baby. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> that took care of them. <laughs> Deleted. Yeah, right. <laughs> Maybe that was an overkill. I'll admit that was a bit much. My bad, guys. <laughs> bit much Bobby a little bit much they're just chilling man I thought that they, I, I, I didn't think it would do so much damage <laughs> ooh another sword nice Yeah, let's go around uh let's go around the long way here. Hey old man. Doing my best here. Yeah, maybe I should have saved the explosive barrel for something a little bit more uh a little bit more intimidating. But you know. <laughs> we live and learn. Oh, nothing around here, huh? Wait, what's with that? Where are we going here? What's with... I wonder how you get up there to grab those. <gasps> well, I take it that that's bad for your health. Don't go wandering on in there. <laughs> Do, do any of you guys just do one? Oh, whatever. Alright, so. Got this chain right here. Oh, you keep sinking too. Chain makes me curious. Oh, need to change over to this. That didn't matter. My arrow, I was like, no, I don't want to lose that. Okay. Hmm. Okay. All right. 
Lesson learned. Maybe I can't do that just yet. I'll have to remember that for later. Hmm. What if? Oh, did you see the little lizard? Oh, that thing was adorable. No, I can't move anything into there. Alright. Well, old man, I drowned in mud twice. But I finally made it. <laughs> Do you see me, old man? I don't see you. I don't know where you went. The old man nods in approval. <laughs> it's like, yes. I too drowned in that mud a couple times. Travel gate registered to the map. Okay. So now we can just fast travel back here, huh? Well, here we go. There's a first for everything. Still angry about the apple. <laughs> still, still upset. Oh man, how shrine. Dumbledore disapproves. <laughs> Alright, Nintendo Switch, do your thing. Ika. Magnesis. Manipulate metallic objects using magnetism. Grab onto metal objects using magnetic energy that pours forth from the magnesis rune. Okay. Object held with the magnetic snare can be lifted and moved freely. What the hell do I do with that? Oh. Oh god damn fucking Jesus Christ on a fucking cross. Okay. Whoa. That's pretty cool. Huh. Pickle and his potatoes. I know, right? God damn, Jesus Christ on a fucking cross. Yeah, screw you, you 
big old boulders. Get out of the way. Rah. Want some of this? What are you gonna do about it? Nice. Okay. Never thought of using the blocks to stop their shots. What the fuck? <laughs> To be honest, I was actually nervous and I just didn't let go of the button. <laughs> this is actually what happened. It worked. Anything else around here I can grab? Alrighty. I'm here, motherfucker. We learned magnetism or magnesis. Ilea? The spirit orb. Well, whatever it is, we have to give it to the old man, right? Broke them out of old person quarantine. Does that mean that they're dead now? <laughs> No, I'm worried. I just killed the poor guy. He's like, thank you. I may now die. Oh! Old man! It seems you managed to get your hands on a spirit orb. Well done. How did you know? Hmm. Clairvoyance. Oh ho. Or perhaps just something similar. As one gets older, it becomes more difficult to see what is right before one's own eyes. However, that which has or was <laughs> once hidden <laughs> from view can often be crystal clear. <laughs> but perhaps that is not true for everyone. Oh ho ho. The appearance of those towers and the awakening of the shrine. Hmm. All connected to that Sheikah slate you carry on your hip. Paraglider, please? <laughs> hmm. It has been quite some time since I have seen that Sheikah slate. Long ago, a highly advanced tribe known as the Sheikah inhabited these lands. And great power of their wisdom saved this kingdom time and time again, but their ancient technology disappeared long ago, or so it is said. It is interesting, however, to think how something like that survived all this time hidden away in a shrine. Hmm. You're just chilling and you broke their little cube bubble, <laughs> went through on ban requests, seems some dude was really interested in cars, <laughs> in, in, it, when it came down to our, uh, Unban request, Miss Murder. These shrines tucked away in numerous places across the lands. 
On this plateau alone, I believe there are still three more. <laughs> Bring me the treasure from each one of their shrines and I'll give you the paraglider. So I need more now? That wasn't a deal. Yeah, I'm fine with it, old man. It gives me stuff to do. I said treasure. I never said there would be only one treasure. Whether it's one treasure or four, what's the difference for a young go-getter like yourself? Since I'm feeling generous, I'll also teach you a trick for finding shrines. Hmm. It also best to survey an area from a high point, so let's see here. How about you make your way to the top of the tower again? Yeah. I admire your eagerness, but allow me to teach you something. Take a look at the map. So those blue icons, you should recognize the cave you were, or that you woke the shrine, blah, 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 blah. Yeah. Travel instantly to the, oh yeah. I mean, I might travel instantly. It's up to me. You know, I, I can do what I want. Or so I heard quite some time ago. I do not know if it actually works. I mean, I could fast travel there. Or I can enjoy the game and what it has around here and just... Do a little, little walkie. Oh, what's over here? I haven't seen these before. A healthy herb growing abundantly in the herbs of, or herbs in the plains of Hyrule. Cook it before eating to increase the number of hearts it restores. <gasps> Ooh. Thank you for the head, Pats. I appreciate it. All about that herb, baby. If Doc was here, he'd be doing backflips for these. But yeah, herb. Gonna get this treasure, bitch. Thank you for the posture check and the hydrate. I do appreciate it. Nar. Something tells me that this isn't working. Place this over here. No, I, I said over here. What's that? Hmm. Yeah, thank you for the hydrate. Gotta get that good stuff. Put it in the hole? No. Put it in the hole. Oh. You found me. The Korok. Is that how you pronounce it? Hey, man. You're not Hetsu. Hetsu? Hetsu? Didn't know your kind could see. The children of the forest. Well, if you run into Hetsu, or Hestu, please return me to him. Or whatever. Return this to him. I don't know. <clears throat> I can't read now. <laughs> We're going from out loud reading to, to in brain reading. So. I'll leave the words up there if you guys are curious. No, oh, let's see. If you gather a bunch of them, you never know what may happen. There's more of them? Whoa, did you just see that? There was like a shooting star over there. I mean, I can't get to it, but I saw it. Mm. 
I don't know how I'm supposed to get across over there. It seems like... When I try to do this... Wait, what if... Place this right here. Can I climb this? How do you climb? No! <laughs> Worthy attempt. Not like that anyway, right? Yeah, I have a feeling that this ain't gonna work. Well, good try. Let's make our way back over to, uh... Back to that tower over there. I know they said that I can fast travel. It's like 12 a.m. in the game, holy crap. Huh? I almost got jumped, you guys see that? A goblin arm. Skeleton arm. Moving even after <laughs> it's severed from the body. It's kind of gross to strap to your back, but it'll do in a pinch. It's old and fragile. It'll probably break quick. Wait, is there something else over here? Nope, just the bow. And it seems like such a uh, chill game to just kind of... Uh-oh. It reminds me of like a game that I would see... An eyeball. Fun to look at, but it doesn't seem to have much use at first glance. Okay. Could be good for something. Got the wing. Mix. Okay. You use it with alchemy type stuff. Mix it with stuff and things. But yeah, it seems like a game that... Like growing up, I'd always go over to my friend's house. And like, their older brother. And their friends would be playing like some random game on the TV. And this just reminds me of like one of those games that they would have been playing. Which kind of brings back like some like nostalgia that I don't have for a game. <laughs> it feels nostalgic even though I've never played it before. It's kind of cool. I feel like that's how, like, Resident Evil 4 was for me. Or how, how it is now, at least. Feels nostalgic even though, like... It wasn't too long ago that I played it, you know? I know I could have fast traveled up this thing, but you know what? I'm having fun playing this how I want to right now. I'll be in a rush later on. For now, I'm paid 60 bucks for this thing. <laughs> I'm getting my money's worth, okay? That would have been a long fall. <laughs> Yeah, 
We're almost there. Come on, Link, you can do it. Old, wait, wait, wait. Old man, is that you? How'd you get up here? I didn't see you on the way there. That looks like a, looks like two orange glowing things. I got, what, one, two? What about that one over there? No, I remember. I just, you know, chose to walk. Hmm. Oh, that's creative. So I can do this and then place pin. That is so cool. But you only get so many pins. So use them wisely. We got one over here, one over there, and one over there. That's kind of cool. So this little area here is kind of like a, this, this plateau is like a little tutorial plateau. And that's where I died. <laughs> May have done a little cheeky dying over there. <laughs> You know, the paraglider would be great to be able to, I don't know, jump down from here. You know what I mean? I mean, I just, I just, I just crawled all the way up here, man. Alright, the first one I want to go to is this one over here. And that is so creative of the game to do. Like, it's not like, innovative or new, but, you know, I was wondering, I'm like, how the hell am I supposed to, like, remember... Where that is, and I'm like, hey man, just place down a little, little, little cheeky pin here. Oh, you can move it with your controller. Oh, that is so not cool, but still, pretty, pretty nifty. Not gyro baby, <laughs> I know, right? Kind of want to see what's going on over there. I mean, where there's smoke, there's fire, am I right? Wonder if I can turn off the gyro controls. Maybe. That's usually like a thing you can do. Let me see here. Aim with motion controls off. Okay. There we go. Exactly how it's supposed to be. This is almost six in the morning. Look how bright it is for six in the morning. Damn. I don't know if they make it an option to turn it off. Maybe you, maybe there's another way that you can go about it, right? Luckily, we can always turn it back on if we need to, right? Oh my lord, have mercy. Possibly, I'm intrigued. Hmm. Hmm. 
Also, I hope Deli's been doing good, Wreck-It. It's been a little bit since I heard from you. Hope the gaming's been going good and the life's been halfway decent. I know I heard that, you know, the landlord's been a bit of a bitch. <laughs> Not helping out. Really sorry to hear that, man. Landlords. If they weren't a piece of shit, then they wouldn't be a landlord, right? Aha! Uh -huh. Wood. Portable bundle of wood. You can use this to make campfires. You have something to light it. What? I can make a camp... Uno momento. You just drop. Huh. I, I want more wood. Yeah, that is what you were working on recently. Some deadly premonition. An acorn, often found on the ground near trees. Squirrels adore this nut. So you may have some competition <laughs> while foraging. Add one to the meal for a nutty seasoning. Woo woo. All I all I need is Nexi if I wanted a uh, nutty seasoning. Nexi and uh, wreck it actually. Deli's good playing Twin Mirror at the moment. Twin Mirror. I uh, was told today pest control uh, is coming out to the loft. Okay. Not heard a single thing. Oh, Jesus. Nearly platted deadly premonition, which is cool. Cool, cool. Some nutty seasoning. Also sat deadly uh, every single episode of Drake and Josh plus the Hollywood movie. Good. Good. <laughs> The, you need to see the Hollywood uh, movie. It's a part of what makes Drake and Josh as great as it is. If you open up your mind, it's gonna take some time to reply. Hey, another traveler bow. Who are you? Another old man. Oh wait, no, same old man. What are you doing? I'm hunting here. I'll scare off the prey like that. Or at least crush down a bit. Quiet down. Man, this guy's just everywhere. I'm gonna shoot this guy in the face. Is that how you hunt? Yeah. Raw meat. Gotta cook it up, baby. Old man, I'm a better hunter than you are. <gasps> Green mushroom. Stamella mushroom. Chock full of natural energy. Cook it to release the stamina restoration. Ooh. Hey, something right here. More arrows. Let's see here. Let's see if I can remember the buttons. Nope. Okay. Um, other buttons. Wrong buttons, wrong buttons. How do you... Uh, 
keep on forgetting how to how do you hold this thing forward you know what I mean um not like that that yeah. not like that definitely not like that I know I figured it out earlier didn't I There's like a button that you press to, to hold the torch like forward. No siree, not that button. I think I've clicked like every button that I know. Oh, it has to be lit on fire first. Oh, okay. Cool. Uh, let's let's put that away. Seems like B is like the pull out, but we know. Got like Y and then B to put away. Okay. All right. All right. All right. There's a lot to this game, guys. All right. Take takes a little bit of a little 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 bit of learning. I wonder if I put this next to, um, next to this. Oh. Well. Apparently when it says to cook it, it means to use a pan. Good to see you, Gargoyle. How are you doing today? Well, that sucks for me. <laughs> I just... I just ended up burning up those and they seemed like they're actually really, uh, kind of useful, you know? Okay. <laughs> Probably not a bad idea to cook some things up before we go out and... Oh, you can sit at the... You can sit at it? You can pass time by the fire? Oh, nice. Doing great? That's good, that's good. You know, let's, let's try to cook up maybe a couple more of those things. I don't see any more pigs. Oh, what's over here, huh? What is this little sneaky something or the other? I'm doing good. Honestly, I've been having a blast with this so far. Still trying to get used to the controls. Considering like I'm not really familiar with uh, the control the scheme of the Nintendo Switch in general, but I've really been having a good time with this so far. Oh damn, the drop though. He got you. There we go. Yeah, you get out of here. Easy clap. The bonks, what did I do? 
I've, I've been doing great. I've been a good guy. I've been good. That's amazing, yeah. Any plans for today, uh, Gargoyle? Opal. A valuable ore that gives off a mesmerizing iridescence similar to or iridescence similar to the inside of a seashell. Contains the power of water. Hmm. Good for Opal. We walked around here. And then we talked to the old man, like, somewhere around here. Whoops. Oh, you can place a stamp just to know, like, okay, this is where I want to go to. Okay. Interesting. Hey, what's that up there? Well, that's the other one that I've seen. Okay. Oh, man, he survived. No. Stop running, you fool. Where did he go? He, like disappeared. Ooh, let's climb up this and see what's over here. Crouch. Here's my second chance. The world's giving it to me. Gib. Thank you. I got the skillage. Found another one. Another Korok. Yay. Got mushrooms around here. Hey, wait a minute. Hmm. Bruh, bye. <laughs> Bruh. Ooh, acorns. For that nutty seasoning. No, no, it said the squirrels were gonna be competition for picking these up, but... We seem to have quite a bit of them. Let's see if I can throw this into that tree hole. I don't know if I can, but we might as well try. Good to see you, Doc. How are you doing? Shit. <laughs> it was a good try. <laughs> I don't know what I was thinking, honestly. Let's go forward to this pond here. Kill the squirrels. No more competition. Hey, some of that herb. We were talking about this. See, Doc shows up and so does the herb. Coincidence? I think not.
No, but here's something right here. Korok Leaf. Really? Can create a gust of wind strong enough to blow away light objects. Aw, oh, but I can't carry it. Let's see here. Guess we don't need the stick. And I can hear something around here. It seems like it's coming from this tree. Weird. That is so cool. Do what you gotta do, Gargoyle. Appreciate you stopping by for a bit. Ooh, a lot of mushrooms over here. <gasps> oh, shit. Um. Oh, Jesus. How do you, how do you pick a different bow when you don't have any bows? I can change my shield. I can change my arrow, but I don't have a bow equipped. How do you, <laughs> what do you do in that situation? <laughs> They didn't mean to have that one equipped. Hmm. Keep on trying to do that one dodge, but it seems to not be working. Thing might be too strong for us right now. Keeps on saying to take it. Maybe I'm supposed to take it. Let's try to uh, take it next time we get up there. I love the music, it's so goofy.
No, maybe... Or maybe... I wonder... Oh, damn! Hmm. Well, that was a good attempt. <laughs> that was a good attempt! Thank you, Doc. <laughs> what? They're talking shit. Yeah, and you're the one who redeemed it. So that makes you a shit talker. <laughs> you're busy talking shit over there. I uh, don't want to eat that. Yeah, it turns out that we can't really... Oh man, we can't grab the item. For some reason it wasn't locking onto him there, so I wasn't able to do those dodges. Good to see a Spartan King. Maybe we might be trying to attack this guy a bit too early. Because <laughs> he's he's really strong and the one shot's gonna hurt. Oh damn, man. Now he, now he's like doing a lot more damage to us than he was before. Weird. Is it hard to get weapons? Not really, actually. Like, you find we find them pretty much everywhere, it seems like. We survived it, but we did. Nice. I think we kind of are able to dodge it a little bit. That should give us a chance here. Okay, let's see. Ooh, he's unhappy about that. Yeah, I think we're here a bit too early. <laughs> Lots of mark him on the map, though. Good to see you, Hippie Mike. How are you doing? Yeah, we're finally back to uh, being chubbers. Alright, so we will mark this spot on the map. No, it seems to be coming back to life. Um, how do you mark things? And I don't, I don't want to mark the rip. <laughs> okay, there we go. No, 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 no. I'm out of here. Now that's for another time. Ooh. 
You equip it to increase your stealth. Yeah, we, we don't have points. <laughs> Sorry about that, guys. Is he still trying to hit us? Holy crap. Almost 800 hours almost there. 1,200, 4,000, Jesus. Four hours, let's go. Nexty? You actually watch my streams? No way. I never knew you actually watch my streams. That blows my mind. <laughs> well, thank you guys. I'm always here. <laughs> oh, yeah, thank you guys so much for being here and hanging out and, you know, being supportive and doing what you guys do. Rather, if you're chatting or just chilling, you know. I wonder if there's a way to craft in this game, like crafting bows and stuff. He's a busy lurker, huh? I'll definitely take the steak. We gotta cook some stuff up the next time we get a chance because apparently when shit hits the fan, it hits the fan hard, so it's good to have some stuff. Give me the green, guys. Ooh, you actually have to sneak up on him. Thank you. I don't know if I need them, but I want them. Well, that looks dangerous. I think we're heading towards the big skull looking thing on the map. <laughs> what can possibly go wrong? I, I think there is, miss. I think there is. Get out of here, you bats. Whoa, I did not mean to do that. Might be a good thing, though. Oh my gosh. Or maybe it's a bad thing. I <laughs> just set the world on fire. <laughs> Let's wait till morning. Morning's nice.
<gasps> okay, I thought I like I thought everything was brown and grayed out because like they're all on fire the last time we saw it. <laughs> I was like, oh no, <laughs> my bad. Um, what was I trying to look for here? Oh yeah, I was gonna save. Might be a blue guy around here, you know? Ah! I was on fire! <laughs> Put the fire away, damn it! It's fun and useful! <laughs> I need it! And it needs me. Oh, too much fire. Too much fire. Oh, no. I'm a terrible person. Yeah, it did, did kind of burn me a little bit. <laughs> Hey, where's my weapon? There it is. Uh, well, that's almost going to break, but we're fine. The combat's actually like a lot of fun, but it's a lot more intense than I thought it would be. Like, good thing I'm playing this on normal mode. Because I would have been would have been getting my cheeks clapped. Ooh, more fire arrows, okay. I imagine so. Like, it could be just like me trying to adjust to to the controls, because I am, you know, pretty, pretty not familiar when it comes down to uh, playing on the Nintendo, but playing on the Nintendo, like it's like some old console or something like that, but yeah. Trying to adjust to it. And so far, I like it. It's been been a lot of fun. You sexy soul bitch. What are you looking in the mirror again, Wreck It? Wreck It gets caught up looking at himself in the mirror. This is just too too sexy. Take nourishment from these sovereignless souls. Wreck it! <laughs> Thank you very much, man. Thank you very much for the biddies. That's enough. That's enough from you guys. You guys have been too too generous to me today. <laughs> Take nourishment from these sovereignless souls. 
And all the love to you guys, honestly. It's a... What, what do they call it? It's a hell of a privilege to be able to be here for you all. Stream for you all. Thank you, Onyx, for the posture check and the hydrate. I appreciate it. And wreck it again. Dang it. <laughs> Thank you very much, Racket. Yeah, the double hashtags for him. Yeah, it's good to see you, Onyx. How are you doing today? It's always lovely to see you. Right now we're just playing a bit of a... Uh, some Breath of the Wild. Trying to get used to it and understand how it works. Up the mushrooms. <laughs> yeah, hearts out to everybody, honestly. It is a pleasure and a privilege being able to stream for you guys. I'm just at work. Oh man. Now I hope you like mushroom on your burgers. And both of them are badly damaged. Well, it is what it is. Something up here that I can't get. Hmm. Interesting. I think it might be a treasure. I don't know. Alright, so, we've explored over here, around here, we didn't really go to this spot, wait, did we? No, yeah, we were over here, went down here, we didn't go over here though, so let's try to make our way around and down, and then, uh, take a look around we'll probably make our way to whatever it'd be called the shrines get that going at least right doing good side doing good A little nervous because I'm so unfamiliar with these controls, but aside from that, I've been having a blast. Oh, it's the AC unit making them come in. That makes a lot of sense. Um, as far as I know, I think it's, uh, Tears of the Kingdom. That's the one, Opal. Yeah, Breath of the Wild is more... Not that, <laughs> as far as I know. <laughs> I really don't know much about this game, uh, other than like I saw, I saw a couple of people play it, and that's what made me really want to play it myself. Like I remember I watched uh, Noob Shido, he was playing it, but he was trying to do like some speedrun stuff, so I was kind of like unfamiliar and not used to what I was seeing, I was like, huh, 
you know, I, I didn't really get to see much of the gameplay aside from just like some speedrun stuffs. But then I saw Benny playing it, and I was like, oh damn, that actually looks like a fun game. <laughs> What's this? Huh. Looks kind of suspicious. Ooh, a cave? Let's check this out. Some flint. Strike it with the metallic weapon to generate a spark. This portable fire starter breaks after one use, but it can create a long lasting flame if you use it near firewood. Hmm. Well, I don't really need to do that. But thank you. So, like a metal weapon, huh? So, like an actual sword. Okay. I'm keeping the rusty broadsword. I, I'm I'm not using that throughout the whole game, I swear. Keeping that thing. Keeping that thing on me. Ooh, I see some potential meat. Holding you to that. I mean it, I will. In the whole game, keeping the rusty broadsword. I need to get a headshot on this guy. Be very careful, very quiet. Did you just turn around as I just was about to get a headshot on you? Man, the bullshit. Norway. Oh, whatever, I don't care anyway. I think you're dumb and so is your mom. You have a you have a dumb family. <laughs> you stupid head. Give me apple. Damn it. <laughs> Hightail lizard. Lizard found throughout Hyrule. It's a bit slow to react at times, but given the chance to escape, it'll dart off quickly. Cook it with mo extra monster parts to increase the speed. Ooh, okay. Brutal. I know, right? <laughs> it, it didn't feel right. It didn't feel right killing that poor little thing. Now, this is where I died earlier. It was quite the courageous fight, and I, I actually won. You'd be surprised. Whoops, I'm trying to remember. There we go.
Let's make our way to uh, one of the shrines then. Think of going for uh, this yellow one. Which we can't really see, but it's out there somewhere. Yeah, I do hope that work is going well for you, uh, Onyx. If it's not, then I hope it goes by quickly. Ooh, let's see here. Free item. Are there bunnies in this game? Oh no. Me trying to get these controls down. How do you destroy this thing? Oh no. something at it instead. <laughs> My bad. Oh, wrong button. No oh, one shot. Damn. That's brutal. Hmm. And on fire again. Well, <laughs> the fire happens, all right? I can't help the fire. Uh-oh. Oh, buttons, buttons. I don't know if we're supposed to destroy it, or like, just run away from it. Yeah, I think like, even if we do, it would end up like destroying all of our weapons and stuff. So maybe we're supposed to just run away. Yeah, what's the tip? I'm curious. Is there gonna be... I don't even have a shield anymore.
Yeah, how do you how do you do that? Do you just like well now we're all out of shields, but Like how do you shield bash or uh what would the word be? Um like parry it, you know? Oh crap. I don't have a shield anymore either. No, don't pick up your own heads. Stop that bullshit. Whatever the block button is for holding the shield, and then it's like A, but not 100%. Okay, okay. I'll try that next time. Oh, it is. Yeah, it is A. Okay. You know my ass is gonna try this again, right? Oh, you have to do it like as soon as it flashes. Oh crap! Oh crap, oh crap! There! <laughs> Bleh! Yeah, like as soon as it flashes. Thank you for the head pats, Doc. <laughs> okay. Let's see, if I save here, maybe I'll go back to this. I really want to try to get this, you know? We did it! Woo! Let's go! Easy clap. You just gotta wait for that nice flash. Let's try it again. <laughs> well. <laughs> The GGs only last so long sometimes. <laughs> Bring it on, big guy. Okay, so it goes like, and then you click the, that's, that's, that's how I think you do it.
We did it once, we can do it again. Okay. Aw, oh, man, Doc. Power company replacing some stuffs. The power is off. Ugh. Are you just like, uh, on the phone then or something like that? Generators. Uh, okay, okay. Nice, let's go. Saving each time, man. <laughs> GG, we got them both. Oh man, I like the shield. Or not the shield, but the spears. And we'll be... And the Kurok Leaf is kind of cool. Hmm. wonder how you get rid of it then. Well, we did the reflecting stuff. That's pretty cool. Yeah, thank you for telling me about that, uh... Wreck it. I was trying to figure that out earlier. I'm like, isn't there a... Parry or something in this game? Alright. I'm gonna go for a quick BRB. Because I need to pee. And take a Tums. Because I got crazy heartburn. <laughs> so when we're back we'll keep on keeping on with some more of this because i've been i've been loving it i've been loving it it's been so much fun so brb everybody
Alrighty. Only took one Tums. I'm safe. Didn't know until I was like 15 hours in. I was like, bruh. <laughs> yeah, this game really does make you kind of learn a lot on your own, right? Which is kind of fun. I think it really uh, helps build the community. Eggs. Right? Eggs indeed. Thank you for the welcome back, Doc, as well as Nexi. Thank you guys so much. And Mish Merber. Goldie. Jeez, guys. Thank you for the welcome backs. Yeah, it's kind of crazy how even on normal mode, man, you're getting you're getting one shot. It's it's actually kind of brutal, which I I dig it. But I imagine like maybe in the future you get some better armor. Cause right now we're just in a t-shirt and some pants, so you know. Job beige. Job beige. Garbage. Yeah, so what are you guys up to today? Anything interesting going on for anybody? Oh, and this gives us a new ability, I think. <laughs> nice opal. Ooh, a bomb that can detonate remotely. Did it give me two things? Okay. So you got this for that. This for that. That for this. Remote bomb. What is this one? Whoops. Oh. 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 Dang it. Keep on clicking that on accident. So you got a square bomb and you got a circle bomb. Man, how do you how do you just drop weapons? Is there a way to do that? Oops. Also, I want to make sure right here there's a treasure that I want to put. There we go. Okay, um... Button. I don't want... <laughs> I don't want it anymore. I don't like it. <laughs> Wrong button. I'll put that away. Oh. oh. Well, if we put a square one on here, then we can detonate it when it gets over there. Okay. Wrong one. Duh. 
Nice. I could just drop it down too, like that. And it goes away. You go like, bang. That's really cool. Man, there were some things that we saw earlier that we could have probably blown up at the bomb. Huh. Maybe it's a smarter idea to go to the shrines first before you kind of explore more of the areas. No, not that one. This one. And we need some more. A little, little bit more when it hurt. Come on. Nice. Wonder what happens if I go on there. If it'll launch me over. Man. Oh, seems like we made it across. I don't know if there's anything else that we can get. Super relaxed and sleepy. I know it's very peaceful, isn't it? <laughs> Ooh, I think that's an item. There we go, now that's what we wanted to see, huh, miss? Amber. Decorations and crafting. Yeah, so far I haven't been taught how to craft or anything yet. Jump back and forth! <laughs> Jump back and forth! I'm scared to kind of hang out on that one over there because that one has an explosive on it. <laughs> Yeah, it seems like you want to, like, right on the edge here, and then it yeets ya. Yeet! Aw, oh, man. Yeah, that is disappointing. Anything else we can look at around here? Uh... Nope. Nah, we don't have the glider yet. That's why we're trying to do all this, is to, to earn the glider. Your resourcefulness is overcoming this trial. It speaks to the promise of the word that disappeared. In the name of the goddess Aelia, I bestow upon you the spirit orb. We freed the old person from living! Yeah! Now we got two of them. May the goddess smile upon you. Yeah, you too, brother. Yep. Yeah, now we can blow up those kinds of rocks. Good to see it. Now let's look at the map real quick. Oops. Uh, I know it's really cold up there. Don't know how I'm supposed to explore that area when it's so cold. River of the Dead. Oh, that sounds great. <laughs> that sounds like a wonderful place to go to. Let's uh just go, go this way, I guess. Go for a swim in it, right? 
The river of the dead. What can possibly go wrong? Sounds like something that would like make you turn into a skeleton in a way. I don't know what these gears are for. But I want them. Looks like a peaceful little forest over here. Being a skeleton would be skele fun. Skele fun with friends. This game is really, really cool. I like it. Wrong button. Well, that kind of worked. Oops. Oh, keep on thinking of, uh, Keep on thinking of Dark Souls and how, to, how you dodge it in that game. What you gonna do, buddy? Um, for some reason, something tells me that those bees will kick my ass. I think I heard something along. Well, it looks like a hornet's nest, honestly. Kind of scary. Let's, uh... I mean, catching it on fire would probably kill them all. So let's, uh... I heard that you can smoke them out. So let's try that. Uh, buttons, buttons. It's gonna take me a while to get used to all these buttons. Eventually I'll get used to it. Uh-oh. <laughs> well, I tried. Mm. Oh, God damn, fucking Jesus Christ on a fucking cross. <laughs> My bad. I think they're wasps. I don't. <laughs> that would make me feel better if they're wasps. Never going camping with you. Is gonna light everything on fire <laughs> or wreck it. Ooh, a squirrel. You know, something wouldn't feel right about killing the squirrel, anyways. Ooh, what do we have here? <gasps> Can I take pitchfork? Yeah! No way. Can I get inside of it? Oh, man. Yeah, that thing is huge too. You can just, you just walk up and pick up the whole entire thing. The Old Man's Diary. On this desolate plateau, the only pleasure that brings me comfort is cooking. And today I outdid myself, truly. I created the perfect dish. I call it spicy meat and seafood fry. 
This recipe not only restores health, but it also keeps me warm, even when traveling in the snowy mountains. Warm doublé. Doublet. I do not know how I allowed this to happen. It seems I forgot to write down a very important recipe. I know it contained raw meat and a spicy pepper, however, I simply cannot remember what else I used. My age is getting to me. Sadly, only this lonely plateau, I have only my own knowledge and memory to rely on. Still. Oh, okay. I think he talked about the same thing. So we gotta keep warm by eating here soon. Aw, oh, man, I definitely want the woodcutter's axe. <laughs> Thank you, Blue Eyes White Boomer. <laughs> I appreciate it. <laughs> yeah, technically we went back to what it used to be. It feels very nice to be back to, uh... Back to normal. Whoops. I'll take the pepper. Yeah, how are you doing today, Blue Eyes? Okay, now let's see here. I need to start making spicy stuff that will last longer. I only have one meat, though. Pretty much the same. First time ever playing this game, so I'm having a blast with it. Okay, so it keeps the cold down for three minutes. Spicy pepper steak. Okay, okay. I need to kill more meaty stuff. Make it more worth it, you know? Wait, this is an Elden Ring? I'm out of here. <laughs> no, it is. It's the DLC, I promise. Yeah, you guys never seen the DLC to Elden Ring? Come on. I'm sorry, birdie. Oh, it's the old man. Come on, grab the apple. Thank you. Dark Souls 1 be looking different. Wouldn't that be cool, though, if they had a mod for Dark Souls 1 that made it look like this? Hmm. I mean, technically, I've... Done this before, old man, actually. You'd be surprised. I guess having wood is a good idea in case you need to warm up somewhere or need to cook something on the fly, maybe? I don't know. I don't want too many, though. For some reason, I just don't really, uh, see the need for it right now. I wonder if I can cross this if I cut the tree down just right. Uh-huh. Look at me. 
I'm learning. Oh, look at all the apples. Thinking outside the log. What's crazy is even if you're sneaking, you still have to walk slowly. To like make it so you don't get hurt. Or is it just like they know? Yeah, very realistic. Makes me feel like I'm actually sneaking up and killing someone. Ooh, let's go. Fire arrows, I'll take it. I've really been liking this so far, though. It's really calming really challenging at least like for me it is oh if I knock this down I bet I can get all those apples apples leaf I have enough to even share with you do you want apples Does anybody need, need need apples? I got a lot of them. I'll take 20. <gasps> That's all I have. <laughs> I don't think I have 20. The doctor has censored the rest. Yeah, it's been a blast. Like I I feel like I feel like a fish out of water, but I I kind of love that feeling, you know. Because like I I honestly like sometimes I have to look down at the controller to know the buttons. Like that's how <laughs> bad I am. <laughs> and it's 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 kind of fun. Considering this is about to break, let's just go ahead and drop it. She just ended up spinning the whole time? Oh my gosh. I've never seen that before. Yeah, maybe I should have kept that uh, explosive arrow for more intense moments because... Oh, I could have bombed him too. I didn't even think about using the bomb. That would have been a good idea. A throwing spear. Oh, my inventory's full though. Um, Stupid inventory. Okay, um... Guess I don't need this. Ooh, we got a good poking stick. Rah, rah, rah. How am I supposed to get up there?
Um, going to take this. Going to be a hot one today. Yeah, yesterday it, it, it got up to 99, but I don't know what they are saying about today. Uh-oh. Guys. I pissed him off. I pissed him off. <laughs> Helped cool it down. That's nice. That's nice. Yeah, right now it looks like clear skies outside. It's only 11 though, so we'll see. Just how bad it's gonna get. Ooh, five bomb arrows. Yes. I'll be very careful with these. I will not spend them too quickly. Now it's a 18 outside right now. A rush room. Increase your movement speed. Good to see you, Chaos Bean. How are you doing? Yeah, I'm just I'm just learning it all. Really, it's uh learning the controls and everything. I'm very new to like playing things on the Switch. Aside from like Animal Crossing. <laughs> I think we also played a little bit of a uh, Deadly Premonition before in the past on, on Switch and I uh we did manage. We did manage. I'm doing good. Thank you for asking. Glad to hear that you're doing well. Wait, could I just... I think you gotta go up and around to get to that. Yeah. I was hoping I can just climb up there, but I think I gotta go... Do a certain way. The thing is, is, I don't really have too much food that keeps me warm. Only have like three things. I literally just sauteed a whole bunch of peppers together. <laughs> oh, that's what I did. So, what does being cold like? What does that do to you? I mean, aside from feeling cold. You lose health from it? Oh, damn. So you lose health. Okay. So let's see here. <laughs> Blooming autocorrect. <laughs> no problem. That seems to be the next area that I need to go to. Yeah, it's up there. Ooh. Looks like there might be a way across over here. But to get up there... I don't even know how to get up there. 
Looks like you can cross over here. Yeah, let's wait till the morning. It's 8.30 p.m. It's Betty time. It's, it's, it's bedtime for us. Yeah, you do definitely take damage. I mean, that kind of helps. Maybe you use the little fan thing to push the bow. I don't even know how I'd get there. I feel like if I go in the water, it's going to be way too cold. Hmm. Let's see if we can travel up this way. Ooh, woodcutter axe. You oh. huh. don't set fire to anything. I don't know what you're talking about. I feel like I should be careful around here because, like, if I only have so much food to get me through this area. I gotta be weary. Ouch. Oh, he's he's out of here. Yeah, they, they aren't climbing up here. What's in here? Saw a hummingbird moth yesterday? Even have a video of it? Ah, oh, what? Did you post it? Never seen one in person? A hummingbird moth. I don't think I've ever heard of that before. Yeah, so the woodcutter axe... So the axe is better for wood. Not so much a weapon as it is for cutting things down. That is terrifying. A moth that you can mistake for a hummingbird.
Oops. <laughs> Take it. Oh, I think I blew up the chest here too. Aw. Damn. Didn't mean to do that. I wonder if I cooked the seared steak. Aw oh, man. No, you can't you can't cook things twice. What am I thinking? Who am I? Post it in the Discord. Yeah, that'd be awesome. Hope I'm doing this correctly. I guess that's sort of the glory of this game, is you can do it how you want, but... I might be making things more difficult on myself than I need to be. I just haven't found any, like... Anything that can warm me up, you know, like, clothes-wise. Oh. Okay. Survive that. That's okay. <laughs> hmm. Can't move that. We got to the next shrine, everybody. Oh, damn. Oh, a dime. I'm more like, oh, damn. <laughs> this is going to be complicated. Now, what ability are we getting this time? Stasis. Stop an object in time while storing its kinetic energy. The stored energy will act upon the object's flow of time or when the flow of time resumes. Making good use of the stored energy can move even the largest objects. Oh. You've unlocked the Glock. <laughs> Okay, that's cool. No, thank you. Ooh, is that a hammer? Ooh, baby. Uh, let's see here. Yeet. We got the box, baby.
Ooh, there's a chest up there. Traveler shield. Inventory full. Oh man. Hmm. <laughs> you got the yeah the 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 sledgehammer along with the seal there. <laughs> Love it. Yeah, now, now we have the club. How <laughs> you like us now? <laughs> Don't throw it. There we go. That is so cool. We made it with our hammer and all. Keeping that side jammer. You have another axe? We're carrying around three of those things? Damn. How the turntables. No place left for you to run. Box into merchant room. Box <laughs> into merchant room. Oh man, I remember her area. The castle. There is like, I think just like one. There, there are two points in time while speed running that you gotta run past her butt. And sometimes you gotta be really, really careful. Otherwise, her ass gets in the way and it really fucks up the run. <laughs> But there's like one that is a lot worse that she'll she'll end up hitting you and all that stuff, but that's what being told that there's nowhere left to run <laughs> reminds me. Yeah, thank you for the GG. Now I'm wondering... It seems like right here there might be a way to cross. So if I find a way to get my happy butt up there... I can go up there. Because it seems like it's too, too cold to really make your way across. So... I'm just gonna trot on over this way. That should help a little bit. <laughs> so they just stop falling. Yeah, there, there's a lot of safe rooms in there.
Yeah, it seems like the axe. Like, I'm mostly just trying to utilize the fact that I have it. Is not a weapon. It's for wood cutting and wood cutting only. Otherwise, you just launch them. Let's see, how many wood axes do I have? Two of them? Alright, then maybe we should start using an actual weapon, huh? <laughs> My <pi> pulls out a pitchfork. <laughs> well, the axe, you shouldn't use an axe as a weapon, everybody. But, this pitchfork here? Now that, that there. That there's a real weapon. Alright, well that was kind of cool. Hopefully in the future I can find some armor that actually keeps me warm. And it turns out maybe doing some hunting wouldn't be a terrible idea. Make sure that I, uh... Can always have something to keep me warm. Oh, the old man's just chilling. This is the area that we stepped out from. Let's see if we can climb up over here. There we go. I think we're on to something. Put that down, put it down. Maybe we can bomb them. No, wrong button. <laughs> eh, it's a start. Oh, damn, throwing things at me like that. There you go. Yeah, little little smack to the butt usually does a trick for her. Whoops. Still trying to get used to navigating this. Seems like we have a little camp up there. Now that's where we want to get to. Oh geez. And it seems like it's also a very cold place to be. I think I only have like two more dishes that will keep us warm. So I don't know if maybe I should try to cook up some more to be able to keep us warm here, you know? Ooh, headshot, baby. Uh-oh. 
Oh crap. <laughs> Ooh, man, the fire hurts. Okay, so far so good. Eat ice cream. <laughs> Things are too hot now. Well, we do have this up here, so this might be able to help us uh, maybe cook up some stuff to keep us warm while we go up there. It would be cool to explore more of that frozen area, but so far, like while we don't have any, any armor to keep us warm, I think that might just have to wait. Get that health back. Yeah, so far we only have one, two things that will keep us uh, warm while we're out there. Let's try to make what happens if we do a mushroom and one of these. Ooh, that's the thing that we already made. Nice, cool, cool, cool. Okay, then let's let's make a couple of those. Let's go. Eh, just to be safe. Let's make one more. That should be enough. I mean, that'd be three times five, 15 minutes to get up there. And knowing me, I should probably make another. <laughs> Trying to keep some of the peppers just because like, you know, when I can make meat and stuff. Get that morning going. Okay. So now to find our way across. Look a little cold there, Link. Right? This this game has really been like very pretty, very beautiful. I'm really liking it.
Ooh, you got some guys over here too. So mark them up on the map real quick. Um, buttons, buttons. There we go. Oh, there we are. Wrong one. No, that's the stasis. There we go. Now to make our way up the mountain somehow. I love all the birds and stuff like that that you can see flying around. The nature is really, really cool. Getting the hell out of this area. Yeah, right. Like, it is freezing. I think we're on uh, the right track here. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. From everywhere. Oops, wrong button. Oh damn, he picked it up before I did. There, now I'll be warm. How do you like that? Get away from the explosive barrels, Bobby. Axe to the face, you damn right. Welcome back, Professor. How was the Dark Souls? Oh, you're playing Hollow Knight. Oh, okay, okay. Hmm. Spent ages on a boss and got very angry. Did you end up getting past it? Kenemet. I feel you there. Sometimes it's a good idea to just take a break. It's a very mature decision to. Sometimes it's just like, I can't do this right now. Come back to it later when I can. Give it another go later. 
I mean, there's some really difficult fights in that game. You have to have, like, a lot of patience. So it's good to take a break. Let's see what ability we get this time. Cryonis. Cryonis. Builds a nice pillar that are very stable. These pillars can be used as stepping stones or as obstacles. Um, on a nice pillar to break it. Oh. Yeah, yeah, it just it just wears you out. Wears you out. I, I hear you there. It just gets to be too freaking much. Uh-huh. Well, there's a button to just, like, aim it under your feet. Huh. Easy clap. That's really cool. up gates and stuff with it, huh? Oh, crap. Ooh, something right here. The combat so far, it's a lot of fun. It actually has like a bit of a, a challenge to it, I've noticed. Like, uh, it, it could be just because I'm not familiar with the uh, like Nintendo Switch controls and stuff like that, but yeah, like it, it's actually kind of challenging. Like I, I've died multiple times today. <laughs> there's, there's some, there's some difficult things. Let's get rid of this. Oops. I wonder if you can only build these things where there's water. Oh, it seems like, yeah, there has to be water for it to be done. Okay. We grabbed that, so we're good there. That's where we came from. Cool. The last shrine that we needed to get. I think now we have four spirit orbs.
to get the privilege to fight the boss. I have to do so much platforming. <laughs> so you have to deal with a lot of platforming and then you have two bosses you have to deal with after that. Uh, yeah, that is difficult. Takes it like, like I said, just a lot of freaking patience. Like, you know, with Souls games, sometimes it, it, it's a hell of a run to be able to get back to where you need to. And I hate that. With this, you have now acquired all the spirit orbs from the shrines. Extraordinary. That means it is finally time. Link, it's finally time for me to tell you everything, but first... Hmm. Imagine an X on the map, with the four shrines as the endpoints. Find the spot where those lines intersect. I shall wait for you there. Do you understand where two lines connect? The shrines would cross. Like right here? Getting a game on disc, I bet, I bet. It's been a while since I've gotten a game. Um, like physically. The first time I fast traveled, it's too cold for me to wander around. Looks about right, right? Yeah, having like a physical collection of games, it's it's pretty damn nice. Yeah, Tears of the Kingdom. That would be the sequel. Let's put that away. Oh. I kind of want to see... It's not up here, but a little bit more forward from here. There's a little spot that we were able to explore that I didn't get to. If there will be a fourth, maybe they might like start off a new series that isn't Elden Ring, you know? That'd be awesome. I know I'd be looking forward to it. I'd be freaking wanting to buy like the special edition and everything like that if I could. <laughs> Yeah, lore-wise and story-wise, story yeah, not much of a reason. Sekiro 2, yeah, you guys, you guys can have fun with that one. Want to see what they got over here? Came and get up here. Thank you. 
Got a lot of spicy peppers though, that's good. Yeah, there's actually something that I forgot to get while we were up there too. So let's fast travel back up here. I <laughs> still want the Kuan remake. Who knows? Sometimes like, you know, game game developers will surprise you. Dark Souls anime. Probably be like a pretty short one, but maybe. That's if there already isn't one. Oh, you look at the recipe of the thing that you made. Oh. Okay. No, 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 no. Oh, you can make multiple? how many you can make got the opal it also reminds me I think I forgot to get um The thing over here, too. Puzzle heavy? Um, I wouldn't say it's heavy with it. There are puzzles. Um, so far it doesn't feel like it's been too puzzle heavy. Like that one, for example, it's like... Freezing blocks plus water equals being able to walk on water. Right? <laughs> so it hasn't been too crazy yet. Like this, for example, like I need to get to that chest, so I'm assuming that I have to like use the stasis ability on it, then hit it a whole bunch of times, and then bonk it away. Uh, there we go. Well, that's out of here. Nice. Oh, man. <laughs> Wee. <laughs> Okay. Now... Can't fight this guy. I mean, he kind of kicks my ass. I don't... I don't know how I would fight him. Unless... Yeah, I don't... I don't know. But this right here...
Yeah, I think you eventually you get a horse in this game. I think you can like tame him or something like that. Good to see you, Sand. It's going well. Oh, there's a chest in there. Um. Yeah, how's it going, Sand? It's good to see you. Bel on top of it. How do I get below? Hmm. Maybe. Oh, damn. I didn't know you can do that. Hero of the wilds. Good to see you, Dizzy. How goes it? Hmm. Hmm. Love this game. It's going good, works better. No longer suffering from fatigue. That's nice. That's nice. Feeling so much better not having to work today. That's good. Yeah, put work in the bin. Glad you're getting the chance to relax a bit. Ooh. Fire arrows, thank you. Yeah, so far, Sand, I've 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 really been enjoying it. Really nervous and stuff. Oh shoot. Because of uh not being used to the controls, obviously. But I've been I've been really liking it. I could try to fight this guy again, but I still feel like he'd be too strong. Unless maybe the bombs are the answer. Who knows? Maybe. Oh yeah, it's Maria Day today. <laughs> Let's fucking go. Were you in the Switch? About 300 hours? Damn. How long would you say was your uh, first playthrough? Gotcha. Move more stealthy. Okay. Hmm. Wrong button. I'll eventually get used to that. Well, there was a fire right here before. I played this when I was younger. <laughs> Sometimes games just fly over our heads, you know? It was around 90 to 80 hours-ish. Because ADHD brain makes me explore anything that's not the main objective. 
I, uh, I get you. <laughs> I have an idea. I have a little bit of an idea so far. Man, this thing used to be on fire. Now it's not. I know I can make my own fire, but I really am kind of too lazy. It's like a little boss fight over here that I tried earlier, but to no avail, I ended up dying a lot. Oh no, buttons, okay. That worked out well. Yay! Jubber's the moon seal! Yeah! <laughs> You're damn right! We're officially back to being Chubbers. That's sort of the fun of it though, like, you explore, you miss things, and then like, you find out that they're there. Come back again, you know, deals like that. Hey, this guy's are really strong, so let's see if the bombs do anything to him. Wrong button. And those rip rocks, they hit so hard. There we go. So that's what it took. Ruby, Ruby, Ruby. Yeah, I, I really didn't know how to fight him earlier. I was trying to use a sword on the, the piece of flint. Um, but I guess, like, it all depends, like, having a blunt weapon hitting it was better. And plus, that is, like, level 12, I think it says, so. We'll try to keep that, we'll try to keep that with us. Whoops. Yeah, trying to tr trying to like figure out how to defeat them. Otherwise, like if you don't, oh man, they they will rock your shit. <laughs> like earlier, there was a uh, an enemy that I had to learn how to parry. Oh lord. It took took me a couple tries there. Mm-hmm. Alrighty. Grab another water real quick. Elden Ring's map looks dauntingly big. It is a big map. It, it, it's like... Once you get familiar with it, it ain't too bad. But it is a big map, definitely. I know, like, this map so far... From what I've seen, it's kind of like, holy crap. <laughs> Doesn't look as big, but does look a bit chonking. Hmm. 
Yeah, Elden, Elden Ring's map is uh very well done. Very well done. I really like it. Alright, so we gotta head back over here. Which means technically just keep moving forward. If I remember correctly, I'm pretty sure there was like a little spot up here, yeah, that we could have bombed. Yeah, I think I think it's just like being very overwhelmed. You know, they they want like kind of a mission based not not really mission based but more linear go here, grab that, go there, do that. And when you give them the keys and say, "Hey, take the car wherever you want." They kind of get overwhelmed. Yeah, I, I'm the same way. Like, at least with an open world, I personally really like being overwhelmed with how much I can explore. Um, there was one time where I got overwhelmed, like, with uh, Persona 5. Like, once it told me to do whatever I wanted, I was kind of terrified. In fact, I think I even entered the stream and, and, tried, <laughs> and tried to learn, like, what am I supposed to do? Oh, I didn't even know that that was... okay. I'm gonna kill every fly in the United States before I figure out where they're coming from. Well, I appreciate it, Opal. Yeah, I'm tired of the flies, too. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, my friend. That's the reason why I quit games, yeah. It can be, you know, like, it all depends. It all depends on the person. It can just be too much. This looks like the spot. That's a Korok. For all I know, they're just cute. They, they kind of just do their thing. <laughs> So the guy said, make an X of every shrine that you've been to, so... Excuse me, if you were to connect them... Oh, maybe it's the Temple of Time, that's where he wants to meet up. Yeah. That'd make a lot of sense. Without a plan, I am nothing. <laughs> You're just like, I will sit here and wait. <laughs> God, I got the worst freaking heartburn in the history of heartburn, I swear. Yeah. Good to see you, Benny. The hype is real. I've been loving this. No. I've been doing so bad. I've been like... I've been loving it. But you know, me trying to get... Used to playing on this controller and stuff and the new controls, it's been... It's been a ride. Been fun though. Gonna have a nutty kill death ratio <laughs> for flies. Ooh, nice. Gonna be starting it today. Let's go. I'm excited for you. Yeah, for flies. Mm -hmm. Take it easy, Professor. I've I've done pretty good with. 
you know these little dodges? Parrying, I have managed to like reflect those lasers a couple times. But I get overwhelmed. Because like, for example, it's like it's L3 to lock on with Dark Souls. And then it's I think it's yeah, then it's like, oh my gosh, I can't I, I can't think of Dark Souls controls right now, otherwise I'm gonna really end up screwing myself over. <laughs> It's going to be bad. Those who have conquered the shrines and claimed the spirit orbs, I can offer you great power. It appears you have claimed four spirit orbs. In exchange for four spirit orbs, I will amplify your being. So tell me, what do you desire? Well, I was supposed to give the spirit orbs to that old guy. Um, a heart container would be nice. So it takes four spirit orbs to get something like this? Go and bring priests to Hyrule. The old man's gonna be pissed because I was supposed to give him that. Blessing of the goddess has made you that much more resilient, I see. Hmm. Here I am, getting up here quickly. Or get up here quickly. Getting up here quickly. Here I am. How do I get up there, sir? I don't think there's a stairway. Well, I should have put the points in the stamina. I know there's a way up there. He's just like, come up here, man. I'm like, shit, son, why don't you come down here? <laughs> Aha, a ladder. Nah, the shmishmo. So how are you feeling uh, today, Benny? come to show you who I truly am. I was King Rome Bosphoramus Hyrule. I was the last leader of Hyrule. A kingdom which no longer exists. <sighs> the Great Calamity was merciless. It devastated everything in its path, lo, a century ago. It was then that my life was taken away from me. And since that time, here I have remained in spirit form. I did not think it wise to overwhelm you while your memory was still fragile. So rather than that, I thought it best to assume a temporary form. Forgive me. I think you are now ready, ready to hear what happened 100 years ago. 
To know Calamity Ganon's true form, one must know the story from an age long past. The Demon King was born into this kingdom, but his transformation into malice created the horror you see now. Stories of Ganon were passed from generation to generation in the form of legends and fairy tales. But there was also a prophecy. The signs of a resurrection of Calamity Ganon are clear, and the power to oppose it lies dormant beneath the ground. We decided to heed the prophecy and began excavating large areas of land. It wasn't long before we discovered several ancient relics made by the hands of our distant ancestors. These relics, the Divine Beasts, were giant machines piloted by warriors. We also found the Guardians, an army of mechanical soldiers who fought autonomously. This coincided with ancient legends oft repeated throughout our land. We also learned of a princess with a sacred power, and her appointed knight chosen by the sword that seals the darkness. It was they who sealed Ganon away using the power of these ancient relics. One hundred years ago, there was a princess set to inherit a sacred power, and a skilled knight at her side. It was clear that we must follow our ancestors' path. We selected four skilled individuals from across Hyrule and tasked them with the duty of piloting the Divine Beasts. With the Princess as their commander, we dubbed these pilots Champions, a name that would solidify their unique bond. The Princess, her appointed knight, and the rest of the Champions were on the brink of sealing away Ganon. But nay. Ganon was cunning, and he responded with a plan beyond our imagining. He appeared from deep below Hyrule Castle, seized control of the Guardians and the Divine Beasts. Us. The champions lost their lives, those residing in the castle as well. The appointed knight gravely wounded and collapsed while defending the princess. And thus, the kingdom of Hyrule was devastated absolutely by Calamity Ganon. However, the princess survived to face Ganon alone. Link, you are our final hope. The fate of Hyrule rests with you. That princess was my own daughter, my dear Zelda. And the courageous knight who protected her right up to the very end. That night was none other than you, Link. You fought valiantly when your fate took an unfortunate turn. And then you were taken to the Shrine of Resurrection. Here you now stand, revitalized 100 years later. The words of guidance you have been hearing since your awakening are from Princess Zelda herself. Even now, as she works to restrain Ganon from within Hyrule Castle, she calls out for your help. However, my daughter's power will soon be exhausted. Once that happens, Ganon will freely regenerate himself, and nothing will stop him from consuming our land. Considering that I could not save my own kingdom, I have no right to ask this of you, Link. I am powerless here. You must save her, my daughter, and do whatever it takes to annihilate Ganon. Somehow, Ganon has maintained control over all four divine beasts, 
as well as those guardians swarming around Hyrule Castle. I believe it would be quite reckless for you to head directly to the castle at this point. I suggest that you make your way east out to one of the villages in the wilderness. Follow the road out to Kakariko Village. There you will find the Elder Impa. She will tell you more about the path that lies ahead. Consult the map on your Shika slate for the precise location of Kakariko Village. Make your way past the twin summits of the dueling peaks. From there, follow the road as it proceeds north. Hmm. Ooh, the paraglider. Okay, X button. All right, I can do that. Yeah, we'll see about that. <laughs> I, I guarantee I'll still fall a whole bunch in this game. Hmm. Goodbye, Grandpa. Main quest, destroy Ganon. Oh, that was quick. Soldier bow. How we crank it, how we roll. <laughs> Soldier bow. <laughs> okay. No, we're just gonna destroy Ganon. That's what we're doing. Okay. These are key items. Okay, okay. Let's get rid of... You look like you're a mischievous one. Yay! Level 14, damn. Okay, let's take a look at the map real quick. Let's have to go east. Oh my gosh, all the way over there? Seek out Impa? That's impossible. Okay. Well, there is that red thing over there. I wonder... That's a... Uh, what button? This button. And then... Click that. Bobby, you're super cool! You're so kakui this man! Thank you, Leaf! Grab a four-legged friend. Like a dog? <laughs> I, I know what you mean. A horse would be pretty cool. Bigger than a dog, Chubbers. <laughs> gotta, gotta think big. Gotta be careful off of what I jump off of. I only have so much stamina to be able to glide, apparently. So do I always have to teleport back to the Temple of Time to be able to level up when I get enough of those soul thingies? Or whatever it is to, to, to level up. Drop glide, drop glide. There's goddess shrines here and there. Okay. You just kind of find them as you go around. That's good to know. Well, nothing to but to do it. Yeet. Let's see if he can drop glide, drop glide. You can. Oh. <gasps> 
a fox. Hey, buddy. How's it going? You're so cute. It would be terrible if someone tried to kill you. But good thing you're with me. You don't have to worry. Guess that's Clamoreau. One of the first tips he gave me was get a vantage point so you can see what's around there, you know? So that's what I'm going to do. That's what Grandpa told me. Grandpa didn't raise no dumb motherfucker. Oh. <laughs> kind of. I don't want to take a look over there. I'm scared of things being too strong for me right now. So I feel like the critical path is a good path to stick to. A bird. Give me your feathers, bitch. Not your feathers, but your meat. Yeah. You dropped two of them? Nice. Well, I know like earlier I got one-shotted by a blue guy. So I'm a little bit freaked out to just go wherever I want. <clears throat> I'm gonna get my cheeks clapped, you know? Ooh, healing herb. Gib. Not healing herb. I was just kidding. Don't gib. They look like the Hyrule herbs. Is a puzzle? I don't think I can do anything now. What do I do? Set it on fire? Oh, maybe one. Two, three, four, five. Oh, little Korog, look at you. We can count. Oh, that's you, baby Chubbs. That's you right there. You're our little baby Korok. Bye bye. Yeah, take it easy. Little bitch. Sylvie had me looking around the whole house for a water bottle that she thought that she left here. Turns out, it's just in her truck the whole time. God dang it, Sophie. <laughs> Sophie, for fuck's sake. Hmm, look at this little thing over here. A little broken down wagon. Are those the runes that I came from? Yeah, I think I went up here. I did. I think I, all I did was go around that rock, didn't I? I think, that, I think that's all I did. Well, I saw these guys over here. I kind of want to challenge them to a duel. Uh oh. They got a pretty dope treehouse going. Yeah, you better run. Tell your friends. <laughs> yeah, my friends know about it. I mean, how you see me already? Uh oh. Uh oh.
I just didn't see it coming. Oh jeez, they have a blue one. They have a blue guy. No, focus on him. The other one. He's running at me. Yeah, you don't like that, don't you? It's my shield now, bitch. Oh no. Okay. See what I mean is he hits hard. It's really hard. Rob them blind. I'm trying to hit them blind right now. Oh man, he hits hard, guys. He hits hard. I just need a half of one, please. Oh shit, um... Ooh, that damage though. I'm coming for you, you son of a bitch. <laughs> Just stand there watching me. That's terrifying. Bocos, little bok bok goblins. Gonna get your bok ass kicked. Man, that's a good, that's a good weapon. <laughs> that that's kind of gets it. <laughs> I like the spears the most in this game. They keep the distance and they just, they're so quick. Yeah, you and I. Nice, ice arrows. You can farm their arrows? How do you do that? Yeah, right now I only have like 20 arrows. I like the little magic rods. They're weak, but they're fun. <laughs> I don't think I've seen a magic rod yet, have I? The arrow sometimes stays. Oh, that's cool. That's good to know about. Wait. Wait. 
What? No. You're dropping from a height when you use your bow. Oh, damn. Arrows. Now, I'm more about just being scared and hitting them. Ooh, this looks like a good bonk. Is this a good bonk? Ooh, it's a level 6 bonk. I mean, killing multiple birds, uh, that's a good idea. You have to drop it from your bag or just throw it. <laughs> just throw it. Man, this thing's big and chonking. You can grab it back too. Oh, that's awesome in Smash Bros. Little details like that. And the Never Tames a Horse playthrough. Ooh. Pie time. That's the right time. Right? You're speaking our language now. Like Miss Murder said, now to find 998 more. <laughs> Man, that rock really went. <laughs> Look at the scale of this game. Holy cow. I was gonna say, I think I'm going this way. Have a good time, Benny. Enjoy your pies. Hey, your shrine. Actually, a couple shrines if I see correctly. Okay, but I still want to go to this first. Oh, it going. Oh, okay, okay. You meant the rock. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh, I mixed up jumping buttons. Help. 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 <laughs> Okay. We're all right. We're fine. We're fine.
And Hyrule was never saved. <laughs> Now I imagine like hitting the wall over and over again while I was trying to jump down probably is what that to me struggle bus in there. Oh damn. Yay. Link got that thigh gap. Hip window? What are you guys? Oh, the thigh gap? Oh, you guys be tripping. That's like my thigh gap, honestly. You tell me you don't have a thigh gap like that? It's been a while. <laughs> Are you playing some uh, Pokemon, Dizzy? I'm trying to get to there. Hey, what's up here? Hey, what's that? Oh, okay, okay, okay. My bad. I wasn't paying attention. Yeah, so far I've just been really enjoying exploring. This is like, I get two Elden Rings in the same year. <laughs> I like these big worlds I get to explore with games that are actually good. Games that are actually good. Looking at you, Assassin's Creed. Has to be actually good. Has ass in the title twice, that's all I'm saying, right? Ass ass in. <laughs> can you craft more barrel not barrels. <laughs> Arrows? And if you can, how? You can't? Oh man. That's something about crafting earlier why they lie you don't craft food you cook food you don't craft potions you make potions this game's dumb you game stupid game We're almost there, everybody. Oh my gosh. Oh, I'm gonna save.
You get out of here. Boom, boom, time, baby. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. <laughs> boom, boom, time, baby. <laughs> I'm all stealthily walking up to it just to blow them all up instead. Whoops. Was it overkill? Maybe. Did I not want to deal with another one of those blue guys? You're damn right. Yay! Soldier shield. Um, let me handle this. Thank you. We're almost there, guys. Seems like this little tower is almost kind of like protected by all these bad guys. I wonder how we're supposed to get there. Wrong button. Wrong button. Ooh. Wrong button. Scared of water, what can I say? Alright, good shot, good shot. Save right here. Because we're gonna try to light them up like the 4th of July. Katy Perry fireworks style in here. There's a bigums. Nice, you just gotta stab him a bunch. Don't throw that. We want to keep that. <laughs> I'm keeping this rusty broadsword. I picked it up from that rock. And I said that I'd treat it right. Ooh, rare material obtained by defending a bokoblin. Defeating, not defending. I'm like, why don't I defend it? It convulses on its own every now and then. Which is really creepy. But perhaps it has use. It has use. Now we just need to find our way up there. Don't know how, but we do.
Man, I wish they had dropped more arrows. You think your father forgot you? Man, join the club. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm sorry to hear that. That sounds like some bullshit. My pie. I'm sure they'll bring you back some pie. Come on, they know you, Benny. They're like, Benny loves pie. Time to farm some arrows. Oh, coming back with a vengeance, huh? Yeah, thank you for telling me about that with the farming arrows. Travelers <gasps> Claymore. Oh, what destroys the weapons faster, though? Sand? Claymore? This is Dark Souls. This is... Te Technically, this is Dark Souls. Man, it takes forever just to get one arrow. Oh, I see. Setting your weapon on fire. Yeah, yeah. Dude, I'm not getting any arrows from this. Bullshit. You know, I'm just gonna go kill you. Yep, you wasted your time. Now you're in trouble. Five arrows. He drops five of them. He's like, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry I didn't give you what you wanted. What happens when I do one of these and one of those? Sprinkling a little bit of that pepper. Spicy meat skewer. Ooh, Dahlia's gonna be hanging out. Nice. Have a good one, Benny. I appreciate you hanging out and lurking. Are you going to be gaming? Or are you going to be doing art? Because I want to know rather or not if I'm going to miss out. Because, you know. Animal Crossing? Eh, okay, okay. Have a good time, Benny. I'm thinking I like the toasty mushrooms
I got bamboozled. I could have gotten AC DLC instead. Oh, okay, so you got the... What would it be? Well, at least when it comes out, it'll be there. Freaking, I'm, I, I can't remember. The pre-order. There we go. Dang it, I keep on clicking the wrong button, guys. I'll get used to it eventually. Now, I know this is add some nutty flavoring to your meal. You know, like, ah, I just ate it. Okay. A little, little bit of nuts with my apple. It's okay. Mistakes happen. Okay, uh... I'm like an old person having to look down at their, uh, controller, I swear. What happens if I cook one of these? Fried wild greens. Hmm. Kinda sucks they have to do like one at a time, you know? At least I have five of these. That's pretty good. I'm gonna try to make some more of these wild greens. It's like I want to cook like all five of these, but I only want to do not have it like become a shish kebab or a skewer or whatever, you know? Nom nom no. All the foods. That should be good enough for now. Yeah. Got a lot of a lot of healy dealies. Sort. Okay. Ooh, some of your Honkai and Genshin deals. That should be a fun one. Like you said, it should be a couple of hours. Man, I should have put more points into stamina. Then again, it is nice to be able to uh, actually get hit by one of those blue guys and survive. I think I made a good choice. Oh, I'm not going to make this. Your boy's not going to make this. Thank you for the hydrate, Doc. Thank you, thank you, broski. Oh, damn. Good work, good work. Time to Nintendo Switch it. 
the sweet update. Another thing that I notice is there's not music always playing in the game too, which is really nice. Just kind of get to uh, be absorbed in the you know sound effects that are out there, the nature and all that stuffs. There we go. Oh, one of them is outside the the map. Oh, that's kind of scary. Ooh, the sensor reacts when you're close to a shrine they have not visited. If you head in the direction where the reaction is strongest, you should be able to find the shrine. Enable or disable the sensor Y on the map. Hunter flies today. Can't see the pile of flies or fallen comrades. <laughs> Get a flamethrower. <laughs> So in this direction, huh? Let me see here. There's that one right here. There's this right here, but that's in like the big scary area. So I think I'm going to take that off for now. We, we might go there, I don't know. I don't see a shrine over there. That seems interesting. Let me see that one. Alrighty. Well, I think we'll jump off and head over towards that shrine. See what it has for us. It's gonna be a busy day for you, Benny. Pies, maintenance, dailies. What more could you ask for? Can you change the direction of this? Come on, wind, take me over here. Completely understandable, Dizzy. Do what you gotta do. Huh? Only a 15 minute walk. That's nice. Yeah, she's very close. Yeah. Thank you, Korok. Yep, yep. Yeah. 
Oh yeah, hey, I just saw a... Uh... Now remember, I can do this. Uh, what's the button? That's the wrong one. That's the right one. Soldier bow. Whoops. How we crank it, how we roll. That soldier bow in you. Okay. Uh -huh. Yeah, I, I wish a lot of my friends lived close by. That would be nice. That'd be a bit of a blessing. Who put all these treasures in the water? Am I right, Cora? Right, baby chubs? Who does this? Time to start saving for a trip I shall. <laughs> There's another one. There's a couple of them, guys. This game is too chill for its own good. Well, if anything, it'd be me traveling over there. That's for sure. Let's get let's get one thing correct. Still want to see the last blockbuster? <laughs> Are you sure? It's kind of pretty lackluster. <laughs> These abilities and stuff, yeah, it's like very Nintendo, and I love it so much. Like, it reminds me of like, like shit that you do in Mario. It's so cool. That is true. You back? I'm a rich. I'm a rich motherfucker. Man, I hate this. I have the worst acid reflux today. I know it's like not the like who gives a shit kind of feel, but like, god dang. It's trying to exist here. I think it's from the spicy pizza yesterday. You had spicy pizza? Dude, nice. <laughs> but yeah, that sounds like Heartburn City, right? That sounds really good. No, we're like right there, game. Come on. Ch chill out. Chill out with that bullshit. So good, but also, ouch. <laughs>
Alright, let's uh, get our health back real quick. Don't want to get too cocky. Get claymored, fool. Oh, he landed in the water. He's out of here. Let's see, did you drop anything? Oh, five arrows, nice. Now we got 29 of them. Although more would be nice. 20 rupees. Red luster tickles your heartstrings. What the hell? You get rupees in this game? Guess it is Zelda. Didn't, didn't even think about it, honestly. <laughs> I was so caught up in everything else, I didn't even think that they'd have rupees. Sneaky river snail. You <laughs> sneaky son of a bitch. It's just a snail chilling out and it's like, oh, you're so sneaky. Come on, arrows. Contains the power of water. Huh. On trial for being a spy, you sneaky snail. I should have known you're up to no good. Making our way to it. Good guy, bad guy, just a guy. The end is here. Maybe somewhat used to seeing bad omens by now, but that. Well, that's just. Say, but, 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 but. Well, let's just say it's better than most. Mm -hmm. We're doomed. I mean, don't panic. Sorry, who are you? Have you met? Well, it doesn't matter who you are, really. Getting tired of talking to myself. So you've come for a good time. By the by, those strange things that popped out of the ground. Did you see them? I'm not talking about the mushrooms here. I'm talking about those towers. <laughs> Not talking about the mushrooms. They seem to have popped up all over the place. Long deserted shrine suddenly started glowing. Uh. You know what this means, don't you? The end is here. With all this craziness happening. I'm keeping an eye on that thing. Just to see if it suddenly starts moving, you know? Yeah, good idea. Oh, that thing. That guardian. It's worth watching. One of those old stories. Oh, jeez. Better get your parry on. 
I, I did it. I did it twice. I did it twice, but I can I can manage to do it again. Perhaps it's gonna take some tries. Like how baby chubs taught you. Baby chubs would get me killed. That's what baby chubs would do. Baby chubs a little bitch. All right, we'll try to go after it. But first, we gotta clear out these guys. Benny, I've done it before. You weren't here though to see it. I'm gonna try my best though. It's gonna be rough. It's gonna be. Like I was trying, that's, that's the thing is it's kind of difficult. Like I'm still, still kind of learning with it. Like the moment to, uh, to parry, but I know like when the flash happens, that's kind of, kind of around that time. It's, 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 it, 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 t it takes a bit of finesse, you know, it takes a bit of finesse. Should have probably saved before I got in this fight. Just saying. Oh, there was fire barrels. Whoops, they didn't mean to do that. Why is everything getting all scary? Oh God. Link. Link. Be on your guard. Ganon's power grows. It rises to its peak under the hour of the blood moon. By its glow, the aimless spirits of monsters slain in the name of the light return to flesh. Link. Please be careful. Like everything that I've killed has come back now? Okay. And they are like right behind me too. Bruh. Wrong button. Oh, I keep on thinking that I'm playing a different game. Damn me. A map reset? You mean like this concept? I've never heard of it to someone who's played Souls as much as he has. <laughs> I've never heard of a map reset before. What is this? There we go. That's what I was waiting for. Want to try me? Try me. Oh, I miss you, idiot! You fucking idiot! <laughs> you fucking 
There we go. Get poked in the face. Yeah, okay. Wonder how often the map does reset. Every every blood moon, which I guess I'm supposed to just know. Ooh. Yeah, I don't know if I really need that, because I have some good shields, but we'll see. Yeah, I will remove this one. Wait, no. Drop. Pick that one up. Aha. Oh, did the egg not go off, uh, Doc? Definitely let me know if it didn't. Oh yeah, he wanted to try to fight this thing. Bobby, you're super cool. You're so cockily, this man. Hey, that works. Everything's fantastic. It's fine. Damn. Gotta find my way across. Fight that thing. And then we'll go into the shrine. Whoops. Keep on, uh. Keep on doing souls <laughs> buttons. Because it's R1, or not R1, R3, to lock on enemies, so I keep on going like, whoop. One by one, cut the circulation. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Thank you for the steak. I don't want a steak. Who are lives to be on it? No way are we already at six hours today. Nor way or nor. May hang out a little bit longer today then. I'm like just getting into it. We like just started the game. see I just want to delete that and then put a different thingy there um, oh it says it right there okay I'll put a star for when it's a shrine
Whoops, I'm done. Damn, those rock thrower things actually kind of hurt. I don't have time to fight you right now. I'm trying to fight these things. All right, let's save here. Gonna take some tries, but we'll eventually get it. Oh, it's dead. Don't worry, buddy. I see you there on the bridge. This thing's actually dead. Like dead, dead. Don't have to worry about it. And that guy was tripping. Had me tripping because he was tripping. We were both tripping. I was tripping off of his trip. Couple of trips. Oh, yeah, you do. Oh, you do. Do this. Um, yeah, we'll use this weapon. Now, what's the button again? There we go. Whoa! <laughs> Found you. Avoid the mushrooms then. No, he's tripping because I'm tripping. No wait, I'm not tripping. I'm tripping because he's tripping. See you later, Korok. I'm bringing this rock. It's my pet rock. And now I abandoned it. <coughs> <coughs> Apparently I'm dying too. Can't drink water worth nothing. Yeah, thank you for the head pats. I've been needing some of those here and there, you know. Ooh, we got that little pinwheel thingy. I think that's what they're called. No, oh, man. That wasn't too bad at all. It's from Sekiro. Right, the same exact one. Red and white, or the pure white one. Look at you and your Sekiro knowledge. Showing off like that. I don't think I need any of those clubs right now. Whoa. Got one of those guys out here. I saw them in that little cutscene. I don't really want to mess with them. But then again. I kind of do. I like to test. 
the capabilities, the powers of my enemies. Hey you. Bring it on. They call me Stinky Linky. You're about to find out why. Oh. Well, that was easy. <laughs> no, you don't. You don't like the nickname, Benny? the button guys I see that I remembered it ninety three children that's a lot of brothers and sisters freaking outrageous I was dozing off near the end there but Like, <laughs> I, I, I did see the entirety of it. That was messed up. What was crazy too is like, instead of being a serial murderer, it was a serial birther. Ooh, a lot of bad guys around here. I'm sure there's a lot of loot too. These guys, they're kind of freaky, aren't they? Man, I should take a break though real quick. <laughs> Get some stretches in. And then when we're uh, done with our break, we'll be right back for a bit longer. I definitely feel like hanging out today, so. BRB.
Welcome to the bonfire, unkindled one. Alrighty. Man, it says that's a hundred and one outside when it comes down to our uh thermometer. But then it's like it only says that's like eighteen Celsius outside. Also thank you for the follow uh shopaholic, I appreciate that. So yeah, I don't I don't know what that like that thermometer must be like sitting right in, in the sun or something like that so if it was 101 outside i don't think i'd be able to stream right now thank you for the welcome back miss you know it was me Big, but they're not too scary. Well, they are scary and they are big, but they're not too tough. Take it. <laughs> and there's a lot of stuff through here. Damn. Missed this whole entire area when I was, uh, gliding past it and walking on the mountains. I keep on trying to do uh, Dark Souls maneuvers. <laughs> Which is like L1 and R2. So that I'm always like, yeah. <laughs> or doing this. I'll get used to it eventually. Yeah, I guess we can explore the rest of this little area. Before we go to the shrine, at least. Otherwise, I know I won't be able to sleep tonight. And be like, oh man, I didn't explore those ruins. 
They're right there and I didn't explore them. There could have been a chest. though yeah yeah I'm not scared of you blue guys anymore rusty broadsword Wait a minute. I have a rusty broadsword. Oh, I thought there was something special about it. No. Oh. Maybe there is nothing special about my rusty broadsword. Ooh, 40. Apparently they're very popular. Too popular, Miss Murder. I wanted to have the only one. I wanted to be cool. Here we go. I think I get to practice that one parry thingy now. It's gonna be tough. We can do it. Hey, what's this? Rusty shield. Uh, Everything we have is better than that, so I don't really care for that. Bring it on! Or not. Hmm. Guess these ruins really are just ruins. Everything's just ruined here. All right, I think we're good to uh, head over to the shrine. Hey, what's this? Is this a claymore? It's a rusty claymore, but it's a claymore. Come on, my baby. Link would explore me. Opal. Naughty. No. Link is too innocent to explore people. Just a casual boulder rolling, rolling down the hill. Yeah, I bet there's enemies out there, but uh... Yeah. Oops. Farming hoe. <laughs> nice. My hoe now. <gasps> a mop. Oh, I don't want the mop. That is kind of cool, though. Link innocent my ass. 
Link is just trying to save uh, Hyrule or whatever. You know? At least as far as I know. Guess maybe we should just use the rusty broadsword. Mm. Hyrule is in a country. It's a land of beauty and grace. Thank you for the hydrate. Y'all always having to take things out of context and make it worse. Sexualizing Nintendo characters. I'll never understand you. Then again, I look at Mercy from Overwatch and I'm like, ooh. Now how? It started by you justifying mess Ah, oh, don't flip it around on me. Come on. Don't make me feel like a piece of shit like that. Damn. Oh my god, that flung that over there. Man, I need to start putting in the title like no spoilers or hints unless I'm asking for it. There we go. Got some of that sweet amber that I still don't know what you use it for. This place is huge. Damn. What's down here? Ooh, you can get over there. There's an item. No worries, Opal. It's all right. It's all right. It's okay. My feelings aren't hurt. Oh jeez, yeah, that ain't gonna work. My feelings are hurt. I didn't want to spoil the puzzle. <laughs> it's water under the bridge. Like a leaf on a canal, it has passed. I want to go up there, but... Oh, maybe... Huh? 
maybe what you do is you take a little detour with this. Yeah, you eventually turn, I think. Maybe. <laughs> exactly. Nothing can fix what has been done. <laughs> A soldier's claymore plus 20. So you know how I was like, yeah, let's bring this rusty sword everywhere. I was just kidding about that. <laughs> claymore. Now Sai is going to be like, do you still have that rusty sword? I'll be like, I threw it off of a cliff into an abyss or a claymore. Spirit Orb Hype. May the goddess smile upon you too, old person. You have been released. I was going to say, you should be dead. <laughs> Stay dead. I don't know if we killed him. I think he just, uh... Was a spirit needing to be released. You know, we just released the spirit. Little, little bit of spirit releasing, you know. Oh, you don't have to hold on to X when he's climbing up it? Oh. Alright, so we got done with this one. Good for us, good for us. Now... There's this one over here. Well, it's a little bit of a trek, but we can do it. Curious to see. Okay, yeah, we're doing fine. I wonder if like this game, and it comes down to its missions and stuff like that, has you explore the whole entire map, or if there's like some regions that they actually legit leave out purposefully. 
for you to take the initiative? It's like those things in that one game. You know, like, uh, in the first game, how you have those things that pop out of the water? And they shoot stuff at you the whole time? Oh, man, I just destroyed that on accident. <gasps> like that! No, you pain in the ass. Stop it. Man, what a mean guy. Okay, let's try to get a sneaky sneak here. This thing like one shots. When it comes down to the red guys, holy cow. And I don't know how I'm supposed to get across there. Let's hope for the best. Yeet. Got a bass. Yes, the fish. Man, the rain in this game is kind of brutal. I think I already did this one, yeah. Man. Ooh, that thing looks really cool. I mean, I know it was just a, uh, like a deer, but it was a cool looking deer. Get out of here. What? An item, if you want to see float, hold it in your hands and place it on an object that you attach it to. Oh. <gasps> bass! What was the bass doing out here? Poor little thing. <gasps> you had a bass with you too. Or an armored carp. I don't want to try to take on this camp. Looks like they have some stuff and things there. I 
Yeah, right now we've been having some, uh, some muggy weather. It's kind of been like this. Nice. That's a good start. I wonder how they get down from there. And like, how do we get up there and how do they get down here? He's just gonna be chilling up there shooting arrows at me anyways. Like I don't I don't get how you get up there. Unless I try to burn their tree down. But that just seems kinda mean. Then again, I did just blow them all up. <laughs> I did. What the heck? Ooh, another bass. I think that's the one that I had marked down on the map. Yeah, yeah. But that's the one that I want to go to. Mm hmm. It all makes sense now. Give me apples. See that one up there, damn it. <laughs> he says a lot of shrooms. Oh, we're kind of flying through our weapons here. Got to be a little bit more careful, I guess. Thank you. Thank you. I see you. And how am I supposed to get to that? It's like in the middle of the lake. Maybe I can jump from the bridge and land over there. Let's try that out. <laughs> bah. Hey, buddy. 
Don't you be charging at me. I chose to let you live. Yeah, so we got, like I said, you gotta make your way to the dueling peaks and get to Impa. Okay. So right now where we are, might be smart to eventually teleport back over here and find our way up and around here. Because there might be uh, some shrines over here too. We could find our way on top of a uh, one of these mountains. That'd be kind of cool because then we can uh, scout out. Sorry about your flowers. <gasps> Watch out for the flowers. No problem. No problem, lady. Dark Souls 2 will be the end of me. <laughs> what makes you say that, Mike? Well, I mean, I don't blame you, but... Yeah, what makes you say that? Some choo-choo jelly. Temporarily increases your maximum hearts. Mm. My bad, lady. Okay. At least we know the way there. What an odd lady. Hilo Rao Shrine. Found some underground boat area and got slaughtered. More holes in me currently than Swiss cheese. <laughs> oh, rip. Damn, Mike. <laughs> Sounds pretty tough. I feel like um, I've heard about that area before from people playing it recently. I can't, I can't remember it at all. Dark Souls 2, but for some reason that boat area sounds recognizable. I swear, some some of the mobs are worse than the like bosses in games. It's uh quite the first playthrough. <laughs> you'll make it. You'll make it.
month to kill the dragon rider. I'm only level 24. <laughs> well, then there you go. That's a hell of an achievement. <laughs> Freaking month to kill a boss, dude. That's intense. I wonder... Oh no, I'm gonna die. Okay, so the water takes you away. That's good to know. Important things to realize, everybody. You drift away with the water. Oh man, I have a lot of bird to cook up. Dang it, okay. I need to do that eventually. Hmm. Oh, and then you can... Oh, maybe... The bomb... Let me see here... There we are. Dang it. Gotcha. I'm really liking it, honestly. It's been a blast. I've been, you know, still trying to adjust to uh, the controls and using a controller that I'm just not used to and stuff like that, but I think that's just been adding more to, like, the fun, you know, and the newness of it. Oh no. Oh no. Um, there we go. I've been really liking it, though. Honestly. I don't- I don't even feel like I've really gone that far. Like, all I did was I- I got off of the plateau. <laughs> I'd done a- one shrine, I explored this area over here, went over here, got the little tower thing, and um, now I'm over here. So soon I should be going through the, the peaks and eventually finding my way up here. But I'm trying to make sure that I 
do all the shrines I can. There's a shrine right here that I was looking at, but because it's in the other area, I'm kind of scared to. <laughs> because it's in the area that the game hasn't had me explore yet. So I'm like, I'm going to just mark it on the map and get back to that later. So, yeah, I'm, I'm going to have to keep an eye out for shrines and stuff like that when I get over here. Yeah, it is it is a huge map. Huge, huge map. If anything, I think like the most intimidating thing is like, I want to do the shrines. <laughs> I don't want to miss them, so I'm like trying my best to pay attention. <laughs> and then the fact that everything comes back to life, like the reset, like that's fine with me. It's just I wonder like, do they come back stronger? You know? Does everything get stronger when that happens? I don't know. Now we got two of them. I bet you're stronger step, bro. I, I lift a little bit, you know. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah, and this lady, she doesn't like me stepping on her flowers, so I have to be very careful. I think I'm good to... Oops. Teleport back over here. Still haven't found like any armor though, like any, well like anything more than just like what I found on the tutorial island, so. How the hell do I pull out a damn torch? I hate this game. <laughs> I'm still trying to remember how to pull out a torch in this game too, that's kind of relatable. Is there one on top of the mountain? No way. How would you even get up there, though? Maybe. Maybe it's on the other side, though. <clears throat> Excuse me. It would be nice to kind of get up there. Because then I can see further out. Mm -hmm. We can try. You know, it looks a lot smaller until you're up close to it. Oh god. <laughs> no. I didn't like that spooky little piano in the background. Who did that? Was it you, Seal? You playing the piano in the background? Okay, we're almost up here. I swear, if there's a shrine up here, I'd actually be kind of surprised. I'm gonna save just in case. I don't know, I don't trust these rocks. I knew it. I had a feeling you were pulling that bullshit on me.
gotcha. And that's why I'm keeping the hammer. <laughs> Thank you for the head, Pat's Envy. Thank you, thank you. Man, I have to be wrong. There's no way there's one all the way up here. Watching Bobby mostly. Well, I appreciate it. Thank you guys. You guys are very supportive. Did Benny start streaming? Because I think she said she was going to, right? Oh, I'm so gonna fall to my death. Hippie Mike. <laughs> You'll get it, I promise. Oh, she has? Okay, okay. No. Maybe it's not that way. Maybe there's an easier way up there, right? Ooh, if you like making soup, nice, nice. Yeah, when it's nice and rainy outside, that's that's soup time. <clears throat> Excuse me. Yeah, I think I was taking the hard way up here. Give me what you got. Whatever it is. I want it. Man, I swear my voice is already... Well, I mean, we have been streaming for six hours. I was going to say my voice is already given out. Ooh. One apple. Well, then maybe I should give you two apples. Ooh. Good to see you, buddy. I am going to take this, though. Resistant to the cold? Your heat resistance. Oh. We're mountain goading it. It's working. It's working. Mountain goat strats for the win. There it is. We found it. Let's hope it's on this mountain and not the one next to it. Okay, good. Good, I think it's on this mountain.
Ooh. What are these? Nothing? No way. Is that another shrine like way up there? Oh my lord, have mercy, mercy on my soul. How in the fuck are you supposed to get to that one? Am I the only one seeing this madness? Through sheer determination. <laughs> right. Oh my god. I don't know how you're supposed to get up there. I imagine you just gotta go up the other mountain. Good to see you, Moist Taco. How you doing, man? How you doing? Look at that madness. Good thing that's not the one that we were trying to get to. The one that we were trying to get to is... Pretty close if I'm right. Yay! Yay! We found 11 of them now. Fuck yeah, my sleep schedule. You know how it goes. Nice. What time is it for you? Where the hell? Wait, was that the one that I was looking at this whole time? I could have sworn I saw two of them, like there's one on this mountain and one on that mountain. Need to go cry in a corner. <laughs> Need to go. <laughs> I'm just gonna go end it all. I'm sorry guys, I can't do this anymore. <laughs> guys, I think that was the one I was running up to. No way. Was it? No. That's what we're saving real quick. Oh man, that is the one, isn't it? It's on the other mountain. <laughs> oh, rip. <laughs> I climbed up the wrong mountain. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh no. Smoking my feelings away, but nothing new. Yeah, adulthood, right? Huh. 
Wait a minute. These textures are like, I exist and don't, don't question me. Pays nice though, but all this adulting is a little wackaroni. <laughs> Something here seems a little fucky. I can't get all the way up there. It'd be crazy. Yeah, no, it ain't, it ain't gonna happen. We're gonna get close, but it ain't gonna happen. I think we gotta go up from another side then. What, what, what do you think, Link? <laughs> what do you think? Uh, uh. Yeah, I think we're supposed to go up from the other side. <laughs> All right, and jump. What a fool I was. I mean, they split a mountain in half, you know. I had a 50-50 chance of being on the right mountain. And you can bet your ass with my luck, I was on the wrong mountain. <laughs> you can take a guess. I'm gonna get to it. I'm gonna find my way. Like someone said earlier, through sheer determination. And you know what? I have had a little bit of that. Oh crap. Didn't mean to do that. Okay, good work, good work, good, good recovery there. Good recovery. Good. Remember, we are the cockroach. We keep coming back. There we go. There we go, baby. Now I understand why I saw a lot of people just mountain climbing most of the time when it came down to watching random people playing this. Good thing I brought some food with me. Some of that warm stuff. The blip bloop sound is, uh... Whenever I'm facing towards a shrine that I haven't been to before, the blip bloop makes blip bloop sounds to let me know that there's a blip bloop that I gotta get to. Um, so the shrine right here, that's why it's blip blooping. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. 
kind of gets annoying, but luckily it's not the worst noise. Could, could be a lot worse, right? The spicy skewers, baby. Gotcha. You can keep the apple. Shiva near. I worked my butt off to get up here. <laughs> uh, let's see. I went all the way to the top of this mountain and all the way to the top of this mountain. I worked so hard to get up here. <laughs> oh my gosh. That's hilarious. It's such a beautiful conversationalist. <laughs> yeah. There we go. Why do I have a feeling that this is not going to be easy? So we have orange ones. And not orange ones. They're all glowing. Sometimes they stop glowing and I wonder. Hmm, there might be a hint somewhere. You got this right here. That's probably what opens up if you figure it out. Oh, maybe there's a hint right here. Just walked right past it. memory the answers to the other question commit to memory before you start lest the failure you will depart memory before I start Thing goes up and down. Okay. So maybe I can see it from up there. Opal, I th I think there's something else we can talk about aside uh aside from poop. You got that over there, which I imagine you get up there from that door opening there. Now it says that they are connected. Well, why don't we just... 
Make them all connect. Hmm, got that right here. Got torches, they're just kind of hanging out. Nothing up above to really give a hint. Well, that's, uh... I think it'd be that easy just having them all connect. Oh. Wait a minute. Oh, they all make that sound. Okay. That's not the answer. Hmm. What if we try diagonally? And I'm starving. Then again. Doesn't take too long to eat. And then I just sit there all chilling. <laughs> okay, well. Now what? Hmm. Well, that's not the answer. Nothing on the roof gives you a hint. There must be something very obvious that I'm missing here. Like I always say, like, you can't solve a puzzle if you don't have all the pieces. And I, I, I think we have a majority of the pieces here, but there's something that I'm missing. Something that I'm missing here. I don't see a difference in the glow either. The shrines atop these peaks share a connection. Their memory, the answer to the other question. Commit the memory before you start last of failure. <gasps> oh, no way. There's another shrine on the other peak that I missed right is that what it is yeah that's what it is there's that shrine I found you you little pain in the ass come here I knew you were up here. Jesus. Yeah, use that noggin. <laughs> yeah, thank you for confirming that for me. I didn't understand when, but like, I didn't read it as shrines. I read it as just the shrine. And I was like, shrines, peaks. That means there's another shrine on the other peak. <laughs> Oh, nice. Did you figure it out, Mike? <laughs> also, I hope your stream's going well, Benny. Okay, so it's 
the same. Okay, so we got to make them the same? Is that what it is? I wonder if it matters in which order they're in. Well, I think the other one... I made it in a uh, diagonal. I made it diagonal in the other one. I'm pretty sure. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, fuck. We'll see. We'll see. Come on, roll. There you go. That was so creative of him. Oh, would it go the other way? Because it's like backwards? Oh, bitch, I don't know. Hey, is there an item right there? Luckily for Chubbers, there's a VOD. I probably won't use that VOD. <laughs> probably. <laughs> I just wing it and hope for the best, man. <laughs> I don't do smart choices. That ain't my thing, smart choices. I don't like them, you know? Serpentine Spear. Nice. I hope me changing how they're lined up doesn't actually affect the puzzle. Well, like, I hope there's not like an actual answer aside from just having them be the same. Because I swear, I think I made them diagonal last time I was out there. What? Damn. <laughs> I, I could have sworn I thought. And nothing's ever easy, ain't it? All right. Well, wait, or, or is, it, is it supposed to be? All right, let's just, let's just do this. Yeah, it's diagonal. Alright, so like, just go to the other one and make that diagonal, right? I don't, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. You can move both of them around. <laughs> I don't know, Benny. <laughs> Okay, this one reset. So I'm just gonna write down how this one is. I'm not suffering, I'm having a good time. I like puzzles, they're fun. All right. 
Now I'm gonna, so it's one, two, three, four, five. So if I write it down like from the bottom up, bottom being one, so it'd be like, I can do this with numbers, all right? Because we all know how well numbers work for me in general. Okay, three, five, two, four, one. Three, five, two, four. Opal, that's not helping at all. <laughs> I appreciate the effort. <laughs> Opal's like, well, fuck. <laughs> XOXO. <laughs> okay. So that looks out to here. So that means... This one's three. To totally nothing, nothing else. Three. Five. Two, four, one. I, I really am too. Like, this has been so cool. <laughs> this has just been a blast. We did it! Yes! We figured it out with the chat and I. <laughs> we did it! GG! Woo! So that means I might need to go into the other. Uh trying and get that one too that one might be open yeah yeah now what have you been up to dizzy and miss murder No, uh, would that actually would be a good cat nap spot? Nice and spherical, perfect for them. Although they do like boxes, it seems like. Spirit orb, baby. Or snapping your ligaments, cracking my fingers, yeah. When the crack, cr the crack get crushed, the cat get crushed. Uh, as long as you don't put any balls in there, no. Just hope for the best. Killing stuff? Ooh, what game? Or maybe not what game. Playing DBD, just chilling in Discord with Doc. Ooh, nice. Been talking about bugs and nature and stuff. Sick. It's nice talking to Doc. He's a chill dude. <laughs> Miss Murder. Flip it back on him. <laughs> These are the questions.
Wait a minute. But why isn't this one open? What in the dick? Oh, maybe... Now when the other one resets... Oh, let's see. Let's go back here. And write that one down. It's just one shrine. But... There are two shrines. Nar. Nar, Benny. There are two, there are two shrines. Which means there's two rewards, Benor. I promise. Watch this. You'll be impressed when I show you this. You'll be like, holy crap. I didn't know that. I promise you. Matrius, it's good to see you. Check if there's an old person inside. I don't know. It won't let me check to see if there's an old person inside. Ooh, boo. Benny, I promise. I promise. You'll be so... You guys will be so impressed when I do this. All right. So let's do All right, so it'd be that one, that one, this one. None in the middle. One on the side. And one up here. Alright. I'm always impressed by you, Step Bro. Oh. Well, you know. I'm just trying to be like you, Nexi. Haven't really been on Twitch at all much lately. Kind of busy. No, I get you. I get you. Hey, you know you're always appreciated here whenever you can stop by. You guys are always welcome, dear. All right. If this actually works, then I hope if I ever see any any of you guys in person, they give me a high five. I'll be like, what was that for? And you'll be like, it's because you figured that thing out on uh, that game that you played. another one it was another one yeah Woo! puzzle master bobby in the house oh i guess i forgot mm-hmm mm-hmm <laughs> yeah Josh I have all the shrines so I did it too <laughs> I just forgot <laughs> thank you for the grats <laughs> oh man had past Nicky Dizzy out here kicking ass <laughs> now we have four spirit orbs baby
Man, these mountains were bitching. <laughs> uh, really cool concept, though. Like, GG's on that one. That was, that was fun. That was fun. I liked that. Chaos Bean. It's good to see you. Hope you're doing well. Yeah, what were you playing? What were you doing? Yeah, I gotta get to like a less terrible of a spot real quick. Yeah, welcome in everybody. If you guys are new here, my name is Bobby, also known as Chubbers. Variety streamer, playing all sorts of stuff. Today's my first day playing uh, Breath of the Wild. And it is, uh, it is crazy, because I'm very new to it. So, yeah. Ooh, you're playing some Tomb Raider again. Nice, nice. Hope that's been treating you well. Yeah, it's been a lot of fun. Welcome to the bonfire, unkindled one. Oh, thank you, Censored. I appreciate it. It's been fun. <laughs> it's been... <laughs> Something about those dot dot dots don't seem too convincing, but I'll, uh, I'll take your word for it. Welcome to the bonfire, unkindled one. And Charlie Bob, thank you so much. How goes Breath of the Wild? It, it it goes good. We actually just got done with the puzzle. That was like really, really intriguing and a lot of fun to do. Like I didn't expect it to actually be as good as it was. Um, I kind of feel like an old person gaming right now because I really am like struggle, but well... Not that old people have a hard time gaming, but I've been like having to look down at my controller and figure out like what buttons to press and how to how to play it. But aside from that, I've been having a really good time. <sighs> Playing it on hard mode, so I've been dying Welcome very quickly. To the bonfire, oh man! One. Yeah, that that sounds that sounds pretty brutal. Honestly, I'm. I'd be too scared to play that game on hard mode. Because <laughs> I know those kinds of games can be very, very difficult. It's a new go, so I can't blame you. Yeah, it's like... It really is. <laughs> it really is. It's... It's it's uh, very, very new for me. Especially because like I don't, I don't really play um, anything on my Switch. So it's just like very different. Ooh, we found another one. Another shrine. Let's go. Having to adjust to a new game with new controls. Yeah, it's it, it can be a struggle, right? <laughs> it really can be. Take nourishment from these. And also I should I should souls. also uh thank you uh Indigo for the for the follow. Gotta spread the love. Thank you, Censored. I pre- Man, you guys are all too friendly. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Yeah, thank you Thank you for the follows. Yeah, for anyone who's new here, we're live pretty much every day, six hours a day. Or, well, three to six hours a day. Um, I, I like to take Sundays off. Sundays or Wednesdays, all depending. But, usually here almost every day hanging out. Most of the time, the atmosphere here, I, I like to think that's chill, you know? We all just kind of hang out and chat about our days and go about it while I game. <laughs> so, yeah, welcome on in. Oh, what is this? Yeah, I don't know if any of you guys have played this before, but it it is fantastic. I've been having so much fun with it. I get really wrapped up in games like this, not gonna lie. <laughs> Tiffany also? Sheesh. Man, we have a lot of amazing people here today. <laughs> How have you been, Tiff? Favorite Switch game? Ah, oh, nice mattress. 
Yeah, it's, it's fantastic. Oh, thank you, Chaos. Thank you so much for the 10 biddies. Man, you guys, you guys are just doing too much. Too, too, too friendly. You guys are too kind. Much loves to all of you. Trying to uh, <laughs> make sure that I have my OBS going. All right. <laughs> Welcome back, censored. Yeah, of course I know that you guys just probably came in from uh, Chaos Beans. Um, Dream, so if you need to stretch or take a break, completely understandable. No problemo. <gasps> ay, ay, oh, 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 that was so close and scary. I did not like that. <laughs> oh, don't do that game. Holy crap. Of course, I understand 100%. Take it easy, censored. Oh, and maybe if I put this in stasis, I'll be able to get up here in time. Maybe? Then touch the darkness within me. Oh, that's what you meant by a random. <laughs> oh, Voltanis, nice, nice. Thank you so much. Thank you, censored. It is, it is good to meet you. It is good to meet you. Yeah, Voltanis. I hope you enjoy the the seal emotes. GG and good night. <laughs> have a, have yourself a good night, man. Also, uh, Tiffany, if I'm correct, I think I've seen you playing a bit of uh, that one game. That one game I recently got into. Uh, what would it be? What would it be? Call of Duty? Tiffany is uh, apparently a Call of Duty master. No! <clears throat> Excuse me. I've been streaming for a while. I'm losing my voice here. Yeah, she's playing. Yeah, she's uh, you're a high level too, Tiffany. You're a very high level. Like she doesn't just play; it, she like plays it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I didn't. I didn't expect that when I saw that. I was like, wait, Tiffany just just gave me a friend request? What? Turns out she's been going hardcore on that game. Higher level than Chris. <laughs> oh my gosh. Gotcha. Climber's bandana. Climb speed, what? I mean, I get a cool looking bandana. How do you, uh, how do you put on this swag here? <laughs> now we got this nice looking bandana, everybody. It may look like a regular bandana. But it's actually infused with the ancient technology that enhances core strength to improve your climbing ability. Well, of course, yeah, it's it's not just a bandana, it's an enchanted bandana. In case you don't know. In case you may be confused. Oh no. Well, there that goes.
Yeah, increases uh climb speed. That's pretty nice. Pretty useful for where we would have been useful for where we just were. I don't know why bandanas always remind me of uh I think his name is Brett something. He's like a lead singer or something. Brett something. Thank you, old person. May you fade away. Are those fish? Sure hope those are fish. Those things are huge. Are those fish? Oh no, those are bad guys. We want some of this. Oh my gosh, did you see? They just like, they're so quick. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> yeah, so long story short, a Lizophos, a Lizophos, a Lizophos horn. Send out some moolah. Be back on lurk for sure, Dizzy. Do what you gotta do. A Lizophos. Lizophos. Make elixirs with it. Okay. Same thing with this. Got their talons and their horns. Do chickens have talons? Brett Michaels, yeah, there you go, miss, yeah. Doing quite well on these shrines. I was on the struggle bus for a while doing these. <laughs> They're a lot of fun, I really like them. And thank you, Voltanis, I, I appreciate that. Yeah, that's... I'm glad I'm having just as... much fun with this game as I was hoping I would, honestly. Yeah, enough of that. Yeah, how have you how have you been, Tiff? Aside from calling you the Call of Duty Master, I'm curious how, how have things been. The woodcutter's axe, I mean might as well hold on to something. Mountain's a lot bigger when you're just kind of moping on through it. Quitting <laughs> my job that I've been at for 10 years. I think I'll break the news on Friday. The one that's been like overworking you like crazy since day one, apparently. That must be really good. Yeah, that one. Well, that's amazing. Yeah, hopefully I end up finding something better or... You know, like in, any plans after you uh, end up quitting? <laughs> Rock, salt, and meat. Oh, I can sell things in this game? Pardon?
What happens if I sell... 37? 111 rupees if I do that. I mean, I like money. Yeah, those I just have a lot of, so I figured might as well sell them and see. Hmm. Rubies contain the power of fire and have fetched a high price in ancient times. Power of fire, I guess I'll hold on to it then. Yeah, I'm ready for change. I bet. I bet. Sometimes that's really... Gosh, like, I, I, I feel you there. There needs to be a big change in my life, too, here soon. Something. It's, it's, because it's been, like, it's just been a bit of a struggle bus lately for me. Like, you know. Sur surviving. <laughs> surviving, doing well, but... Um, yeah, I need to be doing more for myself. Are you still coming in December? You're damn right I am. Ah. You are damn right. Ah. Yeah, if anything, like, that's what I'm saying. I was telling mom, I'm like, I need to lose some weight because I'm going to be going to... We're gonna be going to California in December, and uh, I, I, I gotta look good. <laughs> I gotta look good when I go out there, alright? I don't wanna disappoint any of my friends, you know? They're gonna make fun of me. Tiff is gonna be like, Bobby, you so fat. Why don't you put down the fork, Bobby? Jeez, you chunky. <laughs> like, Tiffany, why? Why you make fun of me, Tiff? <laughs> why did I even come out here? I hate you. Rap Michael's coming at you. <laughs> Rap Michael's coming at you. <laughs> Shot a dude in the leg and then he fell back in the trap. Oh, what? Wait a minute, a boomerang. <laughs> Landed ass first. You're supposed to catch it? Oh, that's so cool.
think I see another shrine. You know, what is... What, what is... what is real life? Or are these places that you can visit? Little horse. I thought that was a dragon head. I thought that was like... Stay away from there. That's a horse head. Beetle! Wow! <laughs> Gemstones, huh? I don't know what a gemstone is. <laughs> I don't know what... Gemstone, huh? That's what you want? Well, I don't, I don't know what those are. <laughs> Lunix? I think that's how you pronounce it. How are you doing? I don't want to sell too many of them, so I'm just going to sell one of them to him. Well, it said red gem, so... I'm assuming that's what it is, is a gemstone. Yeah, I've, I've been having a blast at this game, honestly. It's just been a really good first day of it. Ooh. I can either buy... 20... wait, what? 20 arrows for 6 rupees each which would be 120 rupees or 5 arrows or 10 arrows for 30 rupees I think I saved the money by going with the fire. I don't know. I feel like I should save my money, you know? But I would kind of like to have some more. It would cost me 60. Yeah, thank you. It's a transaction, my man. Don't don't act like it's super great. It's what we gotta do. Oh. I don't know, like ancient shafts and things like that. I don't know. I'm just gonna hold on to it just in case. I don't I don't know what is really good or what is really not. <laughs> Found a lot of amber though. Crafting since ancient times. Value component in decorating or decorations and crafting. I think I'll sell ten of them. Three hundred, oh damn. Just so I feel like I'm rich. Even though I'm not. But I feel like I'm I feel like I'm rich. Are these apples for the taking, or...? <laughs> Grandmaster, <laughs> stop vibing with this game. Turn, turn it off.
HD elixir, boost your movement speed while running, swimming, or climbing. Oh, nice. High tail lizard and monster parts, he said. Let me see if I can make one myself here. Because I got one of those. High tail lizard. Monster part. How are you doing, Grandmaster? It's good to see you. Hey, I made my own! I'm a genius. Hell yeah. Wonder what other stuff I can make. Some critters. I don't know what this is going to make, but we'll see. Dubious food. It's even, <laughs> it's, it's censored. Too gross to even look at a bizarre smell. Issues fourth, uh, from this heap eating it won't hurt you though so, probably <laughs> Pro uh i want to try this dubious food yeah he looks like he liked it but link will still eat it <laughs> he's like yeah this is delicious man <laughs> But like you probably shouldn't. Like you really shouldn't. <laughs> He's gluttonous. He loves his food. Him and I have something in common then. Yeah, I think I'll hold on to a lot of the elixirs until, like, I end up really needing to make some. I'm not too interested in making elixirs, but, like, if there's something that I seem that I need to do, and I need an elixir for it, I'll just be like, oh, I'll look it up online and see if I can figure it out. I have a whole entire list of elixirs here. That's a really good meat skewer. Didn't think I'd get that much from it. What about two? Much better. I wish there was a quicker way to do this, but I also really dig it. Like its pace is slow. But it kind of reminds me of like, well, what am I in a rush for? I'm just chilling anyways. Got somewhere to be? No. I'm just vibing. Why is this censored? I know, right? The dubious food being censored, huh? I know, I, that's what I was kind of wondering too. It's kind of, hmm. What's going on here?
Whatever it is, he put the censored food into his mouth, so... Also, Benny, I don't know if you're watching, but can I take these apples without people trying to kill me? I want to take the apples. <gasps> Look at the dog! Can I pet the dog? Dog! Can I pet you? I can't. Oh, but he likes me. I think I can give you food. One sec, dog. Eat the raw bird. Like apples? Want some more apples? How many apples does this fool want? Where are we going, buddy? see it what are you what are you talking about puppo I think he just led me astray use the magnet I didn't even see that thing, it was blending in so well. Silver rupees. Which which is a uh, a hundred rupees. I didn't even know silver rupees were a thing. Wow. Yeah, the blood moon. I don't like it. Blood moon bad. I think I was supposed to carry uh, whatever village. Oh. Ah. Mm. Okay, yeah, he, he, he was right. You do just go north. It's all good. I was like, I don't trust him.
Treasure of the Great Bandit Misko. Well, you guys don't want to tell me about it? Alright. Uh, hey. Regular bed? A soft bed is 40. Well, I deserve only the best, right? Oh. We got an extra heart. It's kind of cool. No, are you leaving? Mornings are the worst. I can see that. Mornings aren't too bad. Hmm. Man, imagine that. I mean, uh, honestly, sometimes I do wake up on my like, FML. <laughs> Fuck, it's morning. <laughs> Chubbers is back, you're damn right, Justin. Chubbers is back. Back again. Wait, what? Collaboration with Xenoblade Chronicles 2. The southern sky in the middle of the largest bridge, eastern skull's left eye. Peak tall. Look at the night sky at these locations. Find the red shooting stars. Stars left three. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Uh, nope. Yeah, how are you doing, uh, Justin? Uh, seems like the way that you'd get into there without getting spiked. You would jump off of there? Or from there. I don't know what's up there, but it looks kind of interesting. Getting ready for work. Nice, nice. Alright. I should save this for tomorrow, honestly. I've been chilling here for a while, haven't I? Man, it's been a blast though. Like, I really didn't expect to really... Well, I kind of did, but I didn't... Like, I expected to really like it, but I didn't expect to really, really like it. <laughs> I'm having a, a lot of fun with this. It's been a while since I've been able to... Like, be able to and be willing to, like, push past that six-hour mark and still hang out and, and chill and... You know, just enjoy my time here. I mean, I always enjoy my time here with you guys. But I mean, with the game, you know? It's been a lot of fun. I'm very excited for tomorrow. Keep on playing more of it. I think so far, like... I think my favorite part of it is just the world. Like, the combat is fun. But I think my favorite, favorite part of it is just the, the exploration. You know, getting to look around and be like, Oh, what is this? Oh, what's this over here? Oh, what is this? Oh, what can I do with that? <laughs> and like cooking to make sure that I can make food to eat and actually keep my health up. Like that's, that's really cool to me, you know? Yeah, for real, Justin, for real, man. I, I, I always appreciate you getting to stop by. You're a very valued member of this community. We, we love you, man. Uh, and on top of that, other peeps that we love would be our mods. So thank you mods for modding. And who could forget our viewers and viewers for viewing. Man, thank you. Thank you everybody for the crazy support today. Um, the raid earlier from uh, Chaos Bean, I really appreciate it. 
as well as I know like when we started off the stream you guys kind of just came in swinging with uh, a hype train which honestly thank you guys so much for that <laughs> I, did, I didn't I didn't see that coming so uh you know thank you guys so much for that and uh the new followers welcome in if, if you guys are new here we're pretty much live every every, every day but sunday sometimes uh sunday or wednesday but either way i'm usually streaming almost every day so would have been here if i wasn't sleeping well you got you gotta do what you gotta do man you gotta do what you gotta do i'd rather have you sleeping than being a zombie for reals for reals we care about you do you need more sleeps right exactly yeah so i'll definitely uh see you guys tomorrow you know we'll do some more streaming some more stuff and things um let's see who we should raid out to right now um i don't know if she's ending or just yeah i think she's getting into animal crossing now so i'll hand the mic over to uh benny she's playing some animal crossing i don't know what she was playing before but yeah we'll go ahead and raid her feels good to be back to being chubbers it was our first stream being chubbers the moon seal um oh i forgot to do exclamation point uh raid my bad my bad you guys you guys can say i, I guess hello <laughs> that's that's a good it's a good raid message <laughs> um yeah yeah I'm trying to think if there's anything else i forgot everything should be updated over to the new name everything should be a-ok -okay and good to go um so luckily it's a name that we've used before that you guys will recognize um on twitter discord all that good stuff so as i always say be good to yourselves be good to others self-compassion goes a long way let's raid out it was out because when i checked the dlc oh shit geez. there's two of me there's two of me no shush shush other benny 